Welcome everyone to the channel. We're starting a special so much that's gonna have different kind of games. Completely different kind of games. The first one is a 4v4 Arabia with you see the teams, some of the best teams in the world. And Capture H is getting connected. Casting. Let's go. Connected. Yes. And we are there. We are absolutely there. Let's see how it's gonna work with 4v4. Hopefully it's going to be good. Or they pause it. Okay, that's give me time to put the cast in. Reset. Play all seven. And now it should be GL. A M M D. Tempo. Great. We are starting and now I'm gonna fix the, the chat. Because the chat can't be there. Yeah, you're gonna see everything. Thank you so much. I need to check who was the one who... Give me a moment. No chat, sadly. I love the chat, but there's no chat. And... And that's it. Okay, we are starting, guys. People on YouTube, don't forget to thumb up. To, 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 to subscribe to everything. Is a pause? Yes. Why is a pause all the time? I don't know, but it's gonna keep going in a few seconds. And for some reason, need to go to the casting uh, settings. Taskboard is 45. Is 40. I think now it should be good, right? Everything is all right? No, still not. Gonna be 38. Right? Let me check. Perfect, man. Perfect. Looking good. Looking good so far. Welcome, everyone. Thank you so much for joining. Now, with the, with the TCs in the minimap, the 4v4 should be stronger to watch. Piper, Jordan, Doubt, and Tatotar, Gray, Blue, Teal, and Green. So, these four players, the position from Blue, that is Doubt, is kind of awkward, if you ask me. You know, like in the middle of the map. Is definitely not great. Definitely not great. By the way, I don't know if there was some update today, but I feel that is looking better with Capture H today. A little bit better. Anyway, we will see. Then we have red, yellow, purple, and orange. Hira as a flank. Japanese. Heart. Kel's pocket. And then Nick of Sicilian's pocket is okay. MBL. God's flank. Why? They didn't select the positions. And MBL. <laughs> MBL is sending two villiers to lame. Two villiers to lame absolutely everything. To lame his soul, his. I don't know. Like. Pure laming 100%. Pure laming, man. Okay, well, it's worth it to send two villiers to lane the berries. I don't know. Tato got the Aztecs. Aztecs great, uh, great economy. Then maybe oh, but but uh, he's not finding the ships. I'm going to go to his point of view, zoom out a little bit, and Tato explore. A little bit because can be a problem. He's gonna find the boar, I believe. I don't know, guys, how you how you feel it, but I think with Capture H for the team games is definitely much better. We can see a lot of a lot of things. We see all the resources. Then I can just switch all the time for many other things during the game. But also on the top left, top right, we have all the upgrades, which is amazing. And we have the four tone centers. Do you see when he's idle? Remember that when there is a small dot. You will see there that it's not working, the TC. Also, we can go for the idle time here. But honestly, I think the best is to have... I don't know what you think. The resources here. Absolutely. Anyway, um, MBL is walling everything. Absolutely everything. And we are focusing this area because... Other than that, 
Nothing is happening. Well, we can check resources placement. How is the goal all located? But I think we need to focus here. How MBL is laming absolutely everything. And now just go to take the deers. But what MBL want is to find this. You see? He should send the valley is here. But he see the ostrich. He should lane the ostrich. He should go with the valleys and lane the ostrich. Why he's using two valleys? I don't get it. It's too much, in my opinion. But hey. Might be worth it. We will see. Just let me the berries. Let me the goal. That he has another goal. Okay. The other goals for... Well, he didn't explore any other goal. You can see how Tato's reaction is just not reaction. You know? No reaction okay. at all. Two abilities. He's gonna fight? Oh, wow. Well, he's disturbing him, but there is two scouts. But nay. He's gonna take a villier. Oh boy, he took a villier. That was very annoying. MBL doing friends for sure. He's definitely doing friends, right? <laughs> he's making friends. People are gonna love him for this gameplay. Two villiers, scout, and uh, yeah, he's doing a good job. He took a villier now. He lamed this one. No goal, no berries. Probably worthy. Probably worthy. Well, we can check how MBL got 20 Valise and Tato 18. So, it's pretty clear that what MBL is doing, it's really working. Obviously, he's won't won have his the most smooth Dark Age ever. You know? He's doing a house here. What the hell? Damn. Okay. <clears throat> the eagle is almost taking the scout. Well, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. Look how MBL got both villages almost full HP. That's kind of crazy. Anyway, everyone will be feudal age very soon. You can see how in the north out he's gonna try to wall. And doing now militias. He is with Burmese. Burmese as a flank is not a bad civilization. Definitely not. Heart is pocket. And honestly, look how this generation is so awkward. Purple pocket heart seems to be really closer to blue than the flank orange Hira. And that's why Hira is gonna go fast castle, maybe? Oh my god, look at the walls they're doing. It's insane how much the players are walling nowadays. More than ever, I will say. More than ever. Now he has the goal in front. Look at the terrible goal he's mining, Tato. It's insane how far it is. Where the village is? Okay, Emil is taking, uh, taking the ostrich with those two villiers. And in the north is still Hira. And then he got a little bit tilt when when M when back in those interviews from the for the Red Bull, he called him a waller boy. You know? He's a waller boy. And no shame on it. But now doubt already mm, okay, he's fine. The four militias are there. And doing his RT range. Yeah, but honestly, I don't think I will be able to cast a lot in 4v4. You can see how the frame per seconds are going very, very low, super fast. Let me just do something, maybe to avoid this. I will just put this. Yeah, but it shouldn't happen. Like, I have a, a beast computer. My computer is not even in 15%, but it's still uh, no, it's still not working properly. Yeah, you can see how the units are. Not going great, yeah. I, I will keep a little bit, but I will have to use the normal one. Sadly. Or maybe... Maybe I can... Give me a moment. Let me disable this. Maybe with, with this disabled, it's gonna be better. I will try this. I will try this. It's gonna be probably a little bit less... Uh, a little bit worse graphics when you zoom in. But... It's still... If the game is smooth, it's worth it. I don't know what you think, guys. Yeah, I will try with, with less options activated. Okay. There is some some lame now on MBL. MBL got 23 villages. Now Tato 24. So he's ahead already. He's in some problems. What is he doing? He's doing the barrack on his face. On his face. There you go. On the other side, we see the scout from purple and then green trying to help. Green is Mr. Viper. Viper with the scouts. And what upper is he did, Viper? Double with Ask. Horse collar. Yes. He could do. Remember Bozo. 
now in in feudal age, but you don't want because you want to go up castle as soon as possible. He's sending even a spear. Blue is coming as well. Is he walling? Trying at, at least taking some battle in this position. And now MBL is in troubles. He's in real troubles. The goal is exposed, and he got absolutely nothing. It's true that he's here with the men at arms, and now the tower he's doing in the middle of the map is just epic. If he's doing that tower, is really, really huge. Really, really huge. We see how Jordan is with his scout Persians. I don't know why he's not wanting himself. This is going to be a fail for a MBL. But he's sending more men at arms. Well, he's provoking a mess. You know? He has to be careful with that Valir. But more men at arms. And more men at arms. And more men at arms. And more men at arms. It's going to be deadly. I don't know. He has one Valir. He's going to lose the Valir. Yes, but... How many villages Gray is using? Both villages are down. Now he's going to lead the tower. And why not some spear at the same time? The good thing is that they are using all scouts and archers to stop this. While yellow relaxed. Nikov, Sicilians. We all know how good is Nikov with his macro. And just check. Yellow, Nikov. Look at the foot and the goal. He's almost there to go up. Well, look at Jordan. Seed of food. I mean, you can see the resources here. And then you see how Nico has 500 foot. But if you don't want to check the numbers and you want to check just the bars, you see here that how they can go up to, to Castle Age very fast. He on the left, and now purple is completely wall. Okay, so with Kels, he's going. He's going stable. No problem. Can go knight. No bloodlines, but still. It's a solid sieve. Now the archers are coming. This can be deadly. This can be a disaster. This can be a total disaster. If Hira is coming here, Doubt is dead. If Hira is coming here, I don't know if he's dead, but in a terrible position. Those archers with plus one. Okay, he has army here that I, I didn't see. But now, he should be okay. Anyway, they are doing some good damage. They are working a little bit better together. But the Viper is doing a good job as well. And now, Blue, Mr. Doubt is going to be fine. The Viper on the way to Castle Age. Purple and yellow on the way to Castle Age. The problem here is Jordan. Because since MBL is doing a mess, completely mess, Jordan is behind. Just check the resources. Jordan has 400 foot, 300 gold, and is still not up. Well, all the other three pockets are there. Are absolutely there. Only, only one player with the wheelbarrow. That's the Viper. And I don't know what you think, but since I disabled the, the Ultra Graphics uh, HD, it seems that the game is going really smooth, right? So, it's amazing. It's really amazing. I will try to zoom out a little bit more, but I think the distance I'm keeping is good. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. It's really nice. Now, Blue is chasing some units from, uh, from Hira. Hira got right now 15 army. 10 for Doubt. How is about to go castle it? Look at Hira and Doubt. Both almost going to castle it. You can check also here. 600, 200. Well, Hira, the same. Similar resources. Nice. Very nice. Tatot, according to the lame, he did. MBL did. Look at the mini base. He did. The goal with the tower. He never took his berries. You know? So, yeah. It's, it's kind of impressive. How Tatot is holding the position. But Tatot has 31 villages. MBL, 38, guys. MBL... 58. Oh boy. Oh really boy. Okay. Okay. Yes, finally. Don't 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 send me WhatsApp for that, please. Oh my god. Titanic! Titanic Franali! He sent me a WhatsApp and tell it tell me tell me here. Why you don't put the webcam? The webcam at the bottom. And now he noticed that when you click RC range, all the bar is here. Sorry, sorry, I didn't say anything. Franali! You are out of the mods. You are out of the mods. Completely out. You are gone. Okay? I remove you after this stream. I remove it. But guys, jokes aside, Cavaliers, Chambered in Armor. But honestly, I have to tell you something. Franali is great. I mean, when he sees something that can be improved, something that that a hey, man we can do this better it can be good he messaged me on whatsapp he's always paying attention being so so cool 
I love you, man. I really love this friend Ali. I don't know if he's even with the channel muted, maybe, because probably he's working or something. But anyway, Cavaliers from the Viper. Are those Cavaliers going to be really strong? Look, the Cavaliers got 12 attack, and he has the plus 2 right now, because you can see here the second upgrade from green. You see? This is looking very nice. And the other knights are, well, obviously, with blood, no bloodlines as well. So, these Cavaliers are much stronger than the Kells. Much, much stronger than the Kells. He should dominate, but the problem is Hira there with the archers. So, he need to go back. The Cavaliers won't dominate, because guys, Doubt has right now no army at all. They are in a position here to dominate. In a position here to really dominate. In the south, what are they doing? Well, Yellow is coming with Sicilian knights. He has to be careful. There is arches, but Jordan is coming now. How many knights? He got plus one only. While Yellow, well, plus one only too. The only one with the plus two is, is actually Viper. Okay. But what happened here? The problem with the four before. Oh! The castle he did. I don't like it. Why the castle here? You should make the castle in this position. What the fuck is that castle? Like, you are trying to avoid maybe the front? Yeah, but this area was so exposed. I don't know. Anyway, he got a Siege War shop. Now Viper is doing the husbandry. And we need to check village numbers. 47, 48, 41, 35. Guys, look at Nikov. And, and hard, but Nikov, 57 villages already. 10 villages more. Booming, booming, and booming. NBL, it's... Almost in Castle Age, but not in Castle Age yet. So, Tatot with 36 villages, yes, the last village is gonna be there. Is MBL with the stone to make the castle? Soon, 500. You can check at the bottom right corner. Well, honestly, if Capturage is working like this, it's really nice to cast 4 before like this. I don't know what you think, guys, but we can see pretty much everything. All the upgrades. Obviously, I need to focus in many spots because. There's battles all over. But now Purple is coming with a lot of knights. A lot of knights. Viper has 7. Purple 11. More villages as well. But the biggest difference here is the crossbows. Hira with a lot of crossbows. Second tone center. Also we can see easily. I don't know if you agree. We can see easily the tone centers now from, from all the players. We see clearly in the minimap that Orange has 2. Doubt has only 1. 3 for the Viper. 3 for Heart. 3 for yellow, 1 for red and gray, and 3 for Jordan. It's amazing. It's really good the minimap they did. It's, for me, one of the best improvements they did in the last update. Absolutely. Anyway, more crossbows and knights are coming and raiding, raiding all the farmers. And Doubt has pretty much all the economy idle. How to check this? Well, you can see here, Tatot even more, 22 minutes idle. You know, MBL 20, well, about the same, but Doubt... 10 minute idle. That's a lot. Well, but if you check Hira, what the hell? Hira got even 13 minutes. How is that possible? I don't know. He's under all the pressure. Sometimes these the statistics just... I can't understand. <laughs> at all. Anyway, there has been some resources this link, I believe. No, he, this is bought, sold. Yeah, I like those. But... I prefer to keep their resources. And here we are. Still with the battle. They keep going. But now this is Arambais and, and Cavaliers. Those Arambais and Cavaliers now should take over. He's trying to kill the Arambais. But now the Vipers should dominate. Vipers will kill now absolutely everything. He's coming with the manual, but he's not needed. Now those Cavaliers will kill all. Viper 71 villains. But Nikov on 81. And getting now quite a lot of damage. Why this is happening? Because Mr... Mr. MBL is booming! MBL, it's booming! One, two, three, four tone centers and military from MBL. Let me say you in a in a single word. Zero! Literally zero! You know? Zero! Zero army from MBL! So right now, Nikov is dealing alone against two players, and this can be a snowball game. A snowball game, but if he hold. MBL, with the boom from gods, might kill absolutely everything. Absolutely everything. That's a good point. I was attacked by a monkey. Thank you for creating a, a nickname that you need to study it to remember. Amazing. And now he's going with the crossbows and knights, going around. 
Okay. Yeah, yeah. We all can kill all, I told you. Now there is a castle from Hart. Hart doing a castle defensive. Hart got 14 army. The Viper 14, those are Cavaliers and now Aramis. Where is Hira? 29 army and he need to go. If he's not going fast, it's gonna be a problem. Now there is monks. Few monks. I like this because it's completely different from the meta. Since they picked those civilizations. Now we are watching kind of weird stuff. Not, not normal games. Yellow is still holding and now he's doing a castle. In the middle of his three tone centers. That's just amazing. But guys, there is one player that in my opinion now can dominate the Viper. Mr. Viper, it's on the way to Imperial. Yeah, he has 20 villains less than Nico. 20 villains less. But he's gonna have Paladins while everyone else is rolling just Knights or Crossbows all over the map. Though are, those Paladins are with 20 HP less because they don't have Bloodlines. But they are still Paladins, guys. They are really still Paladins. And Viper will be there for sure. Those are the crossbows. Let's see if they... Oh, man. If they go together. No, Viper is coming. He's coming with the Aramis. Look at this. He's going to go from behind. No, he's going to go around. He's going to make a sandwich. This is a man on a... La, 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 la. You can put the member la, 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 la. Because now, those crossbows are going to get destroyed. With the man on and with those Cavaliers. There is some monks. But now, Hira is going to be... In problems. Let's see the Mangola shot. Need to go back. He's gonna kill another. No. At the end. But, 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 but. Well, they safe quite okay. They, everything, right? Let's see those Arabites. And the Arabites are powerful. He keep coming. But where's Viper? You don't want to lose the army. Because Viper with three TCs now is gonna be in Imperial. He's doing a castle. But guys, that castle for Tatot. Jowers. He needs Jowers. Big problem. Which one is the big problem here? 88 village, 8964. Destruction. Seriously, here. Jordan and the Viper need to dominate. And now Jordan might be able to dominate for sure. Because Jordan is just going to go full aggressive here. And he's gonna be an Imperial while yellow is Sicilians. And I mean if Nikov has 115 villages, which is okay, he's still not the Imperial. Not Imperial, while well, Jordan will do Paladins, Persians Paladins. Guys, the Viper is doing the Paladin upgrade already 33 minutes. Those Paladins are just going to dominate, really. He should kill everything. The Viper has 130 population, but doesn't matter, doesn't matter. We see now how Purple has Halvardir upgrade, that's great. But with the Halves, you don't really have a great mobility. Obviously, Hira... He's gonna have Arbalest as well and plus 3, and that's the problem. He has 95 village while Doubt has... You know what means that? I don't know if that's universal, if that is amazing, and you know exactly what I mean. But Doubt, 64 villages. Disaster. Disaster in my opinion. He's coming with a Mangonel. Those are going to be Paladins. Yes, are plus 4? No. The Viper doesn't have the plus 4 yet. He doesn't have probably the resources. Well, he has, but he's not doing the upgrade. No, the Arbalest will take over now. Oh my goodness. So many Cavaliers, yes. The Paladin is going to be there, but it's still plus four, man. It's so important. It's not doing. On the other side, we see a lot of Knights and then now the Gods. Guys, I really think the Tempiel will take over. Will really take over. I know that there's so many colors, so many actions, so many things to do here. But now, Havardis and Arbalest are going to p -p 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 push. And I cast on top of that kill. Doubt is really so behind. I mean, if he got so many Aramis, Doubt is still... With... Look at his resources. He's miles away to go up to him. But Tato the same. And then, the Jowers are beautiful. Yeah. But guys, this is gonna be gods in Imperial. I don't know. He's gonna spam? Hmm... I'm not sure anymore. The Jowers are... Where's the Jowers? I missed them. What? Where, where, where's the Jowers, man? Where's the Jowers? Where's the Jowers? The Jowers disappear, Capture Rage. Okay, thank you. Now I see the Jowers. Okay, going into the middle. I don't know. The Jowers disappear for a moment. Thank you so much for... The subscription, there's a lot of Arambites. You have to be careful. It's gonna take with the Arbalest and Arambites. Arbalest and Halves, all the Arambites. And where's the Viper with the Paladins? 
I don't know. Where's Viper army? Viper, I need to see the paladins. The, the army's gone, guys. The army's gone. The army is damn gone. Capture Rage for, for a win, but the army was just gone. I see the paladins now. I can't believe what I'm watching. Seriously. Let me put Capture Rage again. No, no, no. I mean, I was like, why I don't see the army? Uh, it's a book from Capture Rage. Now I restart. And here we are again with the Paladins. Yes, hopefully it's not going to disappear anymore. Okay, more and more units in this spot. Now we see good the Jowers. And then Cavalier is going to be Paladins. Jordan is going to dominate in this area, I believe. He, Nikov is in Pedal, but what Nikov is going to do with this civilization? He's doing elite sergeant. Are they good enough? And it's MBL after the booming going to do army? Because he needs to do army. He's gonna go champions. So they have champions and sergeants. Well, his opponent got Jowers. Are you for real? Are you really for real? The Jowers, even if they are not fully upgraded, they do just dominate. They just really dominate. I don't know. Anyway, let's focus and see. Arbalest, Rams and Havardiers, do they have uh, mem graphics? Bluff, mem graphics, bluff, graphics, mem graphics. Bluff, mem bluff. Uh, where's the graphics? Okay, it's still disabled. Now, nah, this is Palace. Now, now they are going to kill. I mean, I told you when they did the civilizations, the civilizations were better. Better for Super for Gamer Legends. Remember that they, they made a reverse draft. So the civilizations Gamer Legends are using, Hira gave to him. And then Viper gave these civilizations to AM. Except in this spot that Daud is having problems. In this one, I think the advantage is just massive. MBL is getting destroyed at the moment. Destroyed. No army at all. No army while well, Jordan 63 Paladins 62 sorry don't want to exaggerate not 63 60 Paladins for Jordan killing everything they just need to hold here and the Lord with 102 villages is just holding with the castle for a really long time now the castle is gone need to go back but then Jordan can just clean MBL out of the map absolutely what is happening right now amazing really really amazing yes the bell on the other side we see how doubt is just holding or trying to gain time is the viper gonna be able with the paladins to do something i don't know because to be honest military now for burgundians is crap against the army they have but viper has 50 paladins and 55 paladins as well from jordan he's doing halt he's doing dungeon dungeon so well i don't know guys mbl got now an amazing economy because he's 69 well is not for so long 68 69 is amazing 69 again amazing he lost everything i don't know if they're going to sling him but mbl did boom into death completely destroyed as you can see Okay, this is so many halves. Okay, I'm just asking. I want to I want to remove from the screen the salt resources. Because with so many players, it's, it's kinda annoying because it's all the time sending message here and I don't want to see that. I want I want the stream more clean and see the action. Too much data for me. Yeah, okay, the Arnaba is scolding. Now he's in Imperial. MBL is dead. Completely dead. Yeah, they, they are fine and now they are four versus three. What do you think, guys? I honestly think that the Viper gave much worse civilizations to 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 AM Temple. I don't know if you agree. Now it's easier to say, of course, because they are winning. And they are winning clearly. Also, Leary is not playing with them. But in this position now, 
He has 38 army, 56, but but yellow and red are dead completely. Are dead completely, man. Well, he's gonna trap. Doesn't matter, you can kill. Anyway, the problem now is that both are... Both are with halves. Yellow and red only halves. So... If Tato is just doing Jowers, and this is exactly what he's doing, Elite Jower Warrior. <laughs> Total destruction. Gallon Wars. What the hell? Tato the 138 villagers. You can see that their population is almost pub limit. While everyone except Heart is struggling on AM tempo. They are trying to push here, but those are Elite Data Miles. Remember that Burmese got also Champions Plus 7. So Champions Plus 7 could be a good choice here, you know? But now the Aramis, those Paladins, they are not doing the Burgundians. The Burgundians are not, not doing the Coastal Lear. Okay. There you go, more Aramis. I only think that they needed the gods as a pocket. And then, seriously, I don't know. Kells and, and Japanese's flank is fine, man. Seriously, I don't know. Well, maybe I'm wrong. I feel that Kells as a pocket is not great. Then gods and Sicilian both with bloodline civilizations. Then the gods in Imperial can just spam all over. While if you are as a flank, you are an easy target. A really easy target. He got a lot of army MBL. A lot of army, but 70 villages. And keep raiding all the time. Now, Jordan doesn't have that many Palines anymore. Well, it's still 32, which is great, but he's trading. And can we see the trade card? It's still not. It's still the trade, say, zero. Okay. Just reporting. I don't know why... Trade card count is zero. But it's student. Well, Jower, there's a lot of army. MBL is still with a lot of army. We might see resources as link. The game is ended. We don't need to see anymore. But uh, yeah, they were sending resources to MBL. Over 4,000 resources was given to MBL. But guys, a game that was looking really nice. But now, Gamer Legends just dominate. And... Uh, well, both pockets. Burgundians honestly didn't kill, but they hold it. Doubt hold it as a flank like a beast. And then here they just destroyed MBL. He came faster. Jordan came with uh, with the Palais. I mean, you gave Jordan or whoever was going to use it, you gave Persian civilization. Like if Persians is a bad civilization in Arabia, Persians as a pocket is one of the most solid Paladin ships. Great economy, and then you go paladins. What else you need? Obviously, you prefer Franks, you maybe prefer Indians, but if you don't have those, Persian is a solid choice. While while AM Tempo didn't have any choice, you know, any any choice, guys. Hopefully, you have really enjoyed. But we can check first the statistics, and then we go for the next game. Statistics, military, Jordan kill. You can see 400 units. 400 units, the other pocket with the same largest army, kill 121. So they give Persians and the other gave Sicilians. Probably, yeah. MBL, 89 largest army, fake. Because he got this link and his village number 130. But at some point, look, he just dropped it and got destroyed. Guys, we love this game for a reason. This is 1 0 for Gamer Legends. Guys, game number two, it's two versus two in a home map. And as you can see, the map is a different one. Let's zoom out and see completely the overview. This is the map called Surf and Turf. That's the map. We have as a red doubt on the left and blue on the left as well, right? And they have Indians on hands. While MBL is Indians and Hira is Chinese. What is the, the idea here? Oh, they have. But there's something that we don't see or everything. This is fish all over. What the hell? Let me check if, if it's all the same. Yeah, yeah. It's all the same here. I wanted to check. 
and uh, fog of war that's why they pick indians guys that's why they pick indians china is a good choice as well because you start with many abilities but why the hell is taking the coal instead of the fish i don't get it the fish is is so good now jordan with the mail okay that's nice and are, are they gonna make a dock in this area because there's a lot of fish too but i don't know i mean we don't know what they are going to do i believe that they have studied the map is a completely different one so it's a meta to be discovered yeah the fish is really really nice but i don't understand those fish in the middle of nowhere like why there is fish in the land like yeah, the sound is beautiful, but uh, I don't see any water. I don't know if it's capturage or the terrain, but here's the same, right? Yeah, it looks exactly the same, but well. I don't understand why they made those fish in, in inland area. Yeah, of course, it seems to be a different terrain. It's not completely grass, but yeah, kind of awkward. This is not Crassini. This is not Crassini maps, you know? Well, but that's what they're doing. Four villages of wood. You can see the distribution and everything else else on food. That he has a lumber camp. Actually, blue does have a lumber camp, I think. Right? They don't. Can I put the chat already? Yeah, I think I can. Put the chat back. If I find it. Let me just put it here. Yeah, perfect. I want the chat, guys. You have to be there, guys. The chat is important, Vegas. Okay. Only for 4v4 cannot be there, I think. Yeah. Well, let's see what they, they plan. Now he did the lumber cam. And how fast are they going to do? Probably... Here I will go archers, because Indians will go scout, I believe. I don't know if they are going to wall. They are not going for the middle. And resources. They are getting closer and closer to go up. The first is going to be MBL with Indians. Going to make the loom. And the scout is a spear. Okay? The scout is a spear. So they are exploring with a spearman instead of a scout. I don't know that. Why, why is there a reason? Oh, look at MBL. <laughs> He's luring with the spear, man. He can't do it, man. In another level, guys. Luring with the spear is the way to go. Yes. Good job. Taking the boar and going up the first. Then now blue and red. While Hira is going a little bit slower. Obviously, China is always a little bit different. And he's bringing... Okay. He lost the spear now. And yellow still need to go up. It's not going up yet. That's not good because I feel that here they can go really aggressive. He has seven villages on wood. And he's going fuel age without the loom. So this is 19 villages without the loom is solid. And Bial will be there with 17 villagers. And loom, right? Yeah, otherwise it would be super fast. How much wood he has, in order to make a stable right away. As you can see here, a lot of resources. Okay, let's zoom out. And we will see what they plan. I just hope that it's not gonna be... Oh! Here is the only one that is going for, for dock. Honestly, if he's able to do some galley, it can be a good defend, honestly. Honestly, here. I mean, of course, it's very... It's it's a really big area to cover, but here I can wall everything, you know, and bring all the action to this spot. Yeah, well, the map is, is hard to wall. I mean, you need to wall a lot, but here I can do it. Now doing the loom, and since there's no scout for that, they probably didn't make the loom, you know? One spear is not gonna kill the villagers like uh, one scout. For that, they didn't do the loom early. 
Okay, he has the dog as well, doubt. But he has 19 villages. Look at here at 24. That can give him a great economy. A really great economy. Uh-oh. Okay, he lost the spear. But that's a mistake. Because now... He, well... He could have another spear to... To face the... The potential scout. I see scouts from both. While Hira doing archery range. I really like it. You know? I think in theory... This is a better what AM Tempo is doing, MBL and, and Hira. Because Doubt can come with Spear Rush. Okay, look at the fish. Uh-oh. But the spear is coming, so he needs to go away. And now he's doing a fire galley. You will do a fire galley or a galley? Hmm. Don't lose the fish, Hira. Don't lose the fish, but the fire galley is there already. Fire Galley is there already. The spear is coming. The Fire Galley now is going to defend. I told you. I really told you. And now, MBL is not going for for fire, for Galleys. He has only, well, another male with fish. And then there is a few spears. That's why, for now, maybe it's changed. For now, usually, I'm not a huge fan of 2 versus 2 because of this. There is almost no teamwork. Like... I don't know if this is gonna change, but many situations you see two one versus one, which is almost impossible to follow, to be honest. Now MBL is just trying to shut up my mouth and trying to go to blue, which is nice. The goal? Why he's taking that goal? Is not better this one? Why that forward? Don't get it. But the scouts are going to be on Jordan base. There you go. He's gonna pick a villier, I believe. Yeah, he will pick one. Or maybe not. Oh, wow. He didn't pick. Of course, he did a little bit, but that's it. And then here, like if they were gods instead of Indians and, 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 and Indians. He's Indians versus Indians. So both going a lot of spears. A lot of spears. And now, I like it. That MBL is just gonna go with yellow. We're gonna go with Hira. While at home, he only need to stay with the spears. So many spears. Amazing. Yeah, because now he just need to go. This is a scout archers. And one spear is sending even more scout mobility. While red is now trying to attack yellow. Yellow, Hira has not real defense at home. Well, he has one spear in this area. But those three fishermen are really close to the TC. And at home, only one spear. He's usually really fast, really fast reaction. So they're trying to make some damage here. But in this spot... Can they, can they do some damage? I like how Jordan is defending. Scout, Archie, Skirmishes. This might delay the, maybe his transition, but... Uh-oh. Hira. Hira with some problems. Losing a villier. And then everything is open. He's gonna wall or not? He should make a house here. Hira. What is he doing? Well, he's not doing a house. I mean, he's not killing, but... This is disturbing his economy. And now, more scouts. And, uh, well, they are together, but Jordan has good army, man. I mean, you can see Jordan 10 army. Well, everyone around the same. But now MBL, 29 villages. 29 villages while... 30, well, he has wheelbarrow. Okay, he's fine. He's fine. He got the wheelbarrow. Now he's denying the goal, I told you. The goal is very exposed. Goal here, and the, he did a tower on, on the wood, but... Now Jordan is in trouble. He's in real trouble because they are playing together. NBL and Hira are playing together. But what is Doubt doing? I don't know. Doubt got 9 army. And where is his army? Because I don't see it. Seriously. Let me go to his point of view. Thank you for to my Seriously? Sykes donated 4 euros and 12 cents. Amazing. Show Thank you. Hype. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the support. Amazing, man. Really amazing. Thank you, man. Thank you, amigo. Uh, he has 11 army, and I don't see where. Okay, some spears scout not doing the tower. He has 6 spears for a scout and 1 galley. Okay. He's not attacking. 
Uh, look at the resources from uh, from AM Temple. AM Temple, in my opinion, are playing much better. They are not killing a lot, but they are going together with a much better army composition. And uh, look at now here. Look at now they are together. And Biel and here are playing really nice, this one. Really, really nice. Obviously, a scout and archers is better. They went with the scout, it's true that now Jordan switches to archer range as well, but it's quite a lot more army. Quite a lot more army. Let's see if now they are going to be able to take this. He has to be careful that the spear is not attacking. He's gonna lose it. And AM didn't make the best battle here. In my opinion, they could be much ahead. But going to castle H, both players is just massive. Really, really massive. Because the others are sit down on doubt 50 foot, Jordan 200 foot. So, right now, Hira and MBL, even if the score is switching, is fake. It's really fake. He got a fire galley, he's not defending, okay? Not defending the water. But now, they should dominate. They should, in my opinion, dominate. We will see. The transition to Castellates says a lot. Really, really a lot. Okay. Yeah, and this, this is so exposed, man. Really exposed. He's doing the market. Uh, he's gonna go use crossbows. Not gonna make a stable also? Nah. Crossbows is fine. Crossbows is fine. And Jordan now sell everything, sell his soul to go castle it as well. So, yellow will need to do damage, man. He need to attack. But he doesn't know what we do, right? We see everything. If we go to Hero Pointer's view. <laughs> okay. He's trying to go or not? No, he's going with archers. He's going to go to blue. He's in Castellage. Both are in Castellage. Both can arrow, crossbow, upgrade. Just ignore the galley, man. He's gonna kill the galley, really? Well. Now he's going. He mind the damage he can do. He's doing a tower. That tower will give him some time. But right now, with the army he has and the upgrades he has, he only needs to go around. Well, he got two towers, but he should kill. He should really kill some units. He's doing a palisade here. And now he's going all in. All in to dominate. One bullet down. No ballistic, man. Oh, what? Two bullets down. Now he's behind. And with the crossbows there, no goal at all. And taking all the farming, that's, that's huge. While green now, light caps. He has light caps here. Plus one, those light caps, strong. But kill the spear. He's killing now the spear, now the scout. He has to be careful. Now I need to focus on the spear. He's gonna take it, just kill the spear, got it. Mm. Well, he can take another village, I believe. I told you, he took another village. Now coming with camels, he's there already, yellow is going around. He hold it. More or less okay, Jordan, thanks to the towers. Of course, the towers delayed your economy. Because now he has no stone, Jordan. Yeah, no stone. And there is stone center extra by yellow, by Hira. I really think that the advantage is massive. But you can take a bad battle and then come back from the hell. The least difference is not so big. Yeah, but how they, they have approached their, their feudal castle transition is much better for Hira. You can see now with great farming, two tone centers, doing the third TC. Well, blue, blue, I mean, blue, Jordan, terrible economy. Also, five is idle here forever. I don't know why. And I know the five. What the hell? Why he has so many idle villages? Come on, Jordan. Put them to work. He forgot, man. And that's huge. The multitasking is so important. Of course, they are trying to micro here, but I don't know, man. Really don't know. He's trying to get the kill. No, no, no. I think they will They will win probably this battle. Because he got more crossbows here, but... 
Yeah, the advantage they have is it's really solid. But what's wrong with the sound? Well, the sound is not the usual that I use because Capture H is not getting is not getting the um, the mod sound. So this is the, just the original sound from from the game. <laughs> Okay, one, two, and three tone centers. Bill will have also an advantage with the economy. So they need to attack, but can do they damage? Mm, 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 mm. I don't know, man. I see. Also with fees, some calais. Cavarses and crows are coming. This is with bloodlines. Those Cavarsis with Bloodlines and Botkin are solid. He has Ballistic as well. No Ballistic at the moment from Yellow and Green, from Hira and MBL. Obviously, MBL doesn't need because he's going Camels, but Hira, Hira need it. Good amount of army, but okay. Cavarsis are coming, but MBL is there. Ooh. Mind if he got the demo? Come on, make a demo. Make a demo. We will see a crazy bada boom. It's not doing a demo. Demo shit, man. It's doing fishing shit. Now the demo is happening, but it's not in time. Holy man. A demo there would be a destruction, seriously. Would be a total destruction and domination. Now gonna lose fish. Now he's gonna lose fish. Yes. He need to go back. He need to go to the center or he will lose all the fish and that's not good. Now Doubt is coming with more camels. Doubt has 15 camels, 52 villages. Let's see if the experience from, from uh, Gamer Legends is gonna pay it off here. But now Jordan is gonna lose absolutely everything here in top of that hill. The camels of the crowbars used to get all the arches going back now with the cab arches. But guys, I'm telling you, in this kind of game situations, Hira usually is so dangerous. His boom is just insane. Check out the economy. 77 billions. Three tons sent this crazy amount of farms. And here we are with crossbows all together. I don't know if he used it, the demo rap. No, 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 he's there. He's there. The Kavachis are coming. Why no? Not any navy here? I don't know. Still two tons sent. Jordan is still only one T. See, only one tone center, crazy. And now, oh, down with the demo. Okay. Nah, it's, it's so difficult to, to surprise them. Also, probably with the War Galley upgrade, it will be different, but... Nah, they have a lot. They really have a lot. And this spot is a problem for him, for Hira. Hira has crossbows. He took a couple of villages, maybe one or two. But let's see, 54 villages, 85, and still also with some good army. They, they are not really attacking. They are not really attacking because they have been ahead all the time. That's good dancing. You need to go back. Those are heal advantage. You need to send more crossbows because those cav arches really eat. The long run, they, they should eat because they have 65 HP. Well, the crossbows, 35. He's gonna take those. As you can see, they kill all the crossbows are going down. But Hera is on the way to Imperial. It's true that now not a lot of army here is gonna lose more villages. That's what you need to do when you are 1 TC, but you need to push more. Hera is also on the other side. Daud is suffering the consequence. Here to be two versus one. What surprised me a lot is that Daud, even in this situation, is still almost same villains than MBL. MBL should be much more ahead, I think. Now he's denying a stone, denying gold, and taking farmers as well. Is he attacking? There you go. Yellow has ballistic. Yes, he does. You can see on that bar, but now no, I believe we'll go down. Ay, ay, ay. He will go Arbalest. He is doing a castle that is good. He's protecting gold and stone. I don't know if he should do. Hmm, probably is that Jordan has, well, 24 farmers. Not an oath to, to switch to cavalry. And probably Arbalest is an oath here. Yeah, I mean, why Jordan is still on one TC? That's something that I don't know. And this is the answer. He's doing now the second tone center. But I insist. Very, very slow. 
I mean, his opponent is him, and he's with two TCs. Now, this army from Jordan, Cavarses, and now the camels combine, they clean most of the army, man. And he's Imperial Age with no army at all. But the castle he's doing is insane. Look at the castle Hira is doing instead of doing in this area. He went forward with 20,000 villiers. Actually, 19 villiers, so a lot, a lot of villiers. What he's not expecting is that he's gonna be in Imperial. And he being in Imperial only has one minute. Game over, guys. I'll at four. You can't do anything at all. He's gonna go traps or not? He's doing trap with it. Also, Bresser, plus one attack. Extra, plus three, now chemistry. The camels are coming, and where is that? Oh, the demo, man. I mean, if Hira drop another castle, for example, it's, it's, just, it's just insane. It's gonna be garbaless. This Chukunus is great, but seriously, what he can do now here? Don't think he can do anything, really. The game has been controlled during all the game by by AM Tempo. I honestly think that this this couple here on MBL, I don't know what you think, guys. This is stronger than 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 Delta Jordan. Like here on MBL together, is stronger than Delta Jordan, and that's for sure because. Well, civilization, and they are calling the GG. Well, GG, guys. GG 1-1. One, one. Uh, one game that has been more macro game. They did also a, a better strategy. In my opinion, a really, really better strategy. They went more standard. Also, a little bit slower, Mr. Hira. We will check and uh, in the statistics. But with economy on, on water and also Chinese bonus... And he went arches right away. While both blue and red going to scout was kind of awkward, if, if you ask me, you know. Jordan 33 army. Yeah, he killed MBL 33. But the economy. Look at the MBL economy with Jordan compared, for example. That's crazy. You know, well, Jordan was with 66 villages only. So couldn't do the damage. When you go that late at NTC, you need to raid. And they really didn't. Guys, let's go for game number three. Game number three is one of those games that I really want to watch. Why? Because I love, I love the three versus three. And here we are with three versus three in a map with a lot of mangrove. But <laughs> I was sure about that. The mangrove eats a lot of resources, but you need to could to get inside. So what are they going to do here? I have no idea. Because they are not going to go directly. And also they can't send villages. They need to transport. What the hell? But there is small resources in the outside. What is these maps? Well, but they have resources. Okay. So let's see how it's going to be the game. We have as a pocket. Hira, the Vikings. As a pocket. Portuguese, the other pocket. On a flank, purple with Celts. On the other flank, Tatot with Teutons, facing hard Aztecs. While in the north, it's a Spanish MBL versus Celts Jordan. The lumber camp in this spot. That's a good lumber camp. Gonna chop those trees, and if you really want, also you can chop those with one villager. Honestly, I will do that. Even more with Celts. I know that the efficiency here is gonna be better, but that's it, you know. Anyway. This will be a long game. Mm, I don't know why it should be a long game. They can they can finish the game in early game because they are connected, so they can attack on land and then ignore completely the middle. I wouldn't be surprised that they do, but right now, yeah, they are cutting here. Well, this is a smart by Jordan. They are going to do the same probably. Tato is just focusing in this area, while. Nobody else from the other team is cutting that way. Look at MBL. Minute three. Wally, guys. <laughs> MBL, minute three, and he's Wally, guys. Amazing. Let's see the hill. Who got the hill? Blue. Blue got the hill, man. No, no, he got the hill. What? Servidor. Servidor. Okay. 
That's a traditional Spanish, not Spanish, actual modern Spanish, but the game is supposed to be yeah. not in the modern age, so servidor. Anyway, he's walling now, man. He's walling. You're gonna take the board. Let's see MBL. And what is the idea here with, with MBL? He got 21 HP, blue 20 HP, still 1 HP less. Oh my god. Now he took the advantage. Nice. Monday. And another help. The Vikings. What? Point. This surf is again in the. What the fuck is these maps? I mean, seriously, man. Stop with the fish in the in the in the in the, in the ground. <sighs> seriously, it's hard even to see it. You know, like. Yeah, well, it's kind of awkward to me. At least make a, a different terrain. I mean, I don't mind to have fish, but but change the terrain because here, I believe that you can that you can build anything. No, I mean I don't know, but it seems so. Anyway, both flanks are doing now the loom. What is he going to do? Look at MBL, professional waller, amazing waller actually. I think this is open already. And what is Jordan going to do? He's doing the loom now, I'm gonna make more villiers. Okay. Yeah. But look at Tato. Tato is going already barrack and malicious. I told you that doesn't have to be really long game. It depends how they play it. But Tato is gonna be fully wall in front. Going with the malicious. This is our resubscription. Vamos, amigo. Gracias. Can't see Viper stat. Oh, you are right. Sorry. The, Vamos, the, the amigo. Is, is there. One moment. The chat is there. That's it. No more chat. Sorry, guys. Well, you see now the Viper. Now he's doing a sickle lambrican. The Vikings. Hira. Taking the fish. Doing the loom. And doing more villages, right? No, no, no. He's on the way to feudal age. What is he planning to do? I have no idea. What is he going to do as a pocket now? Three bullets on goal. He's trying to chop the trees. He's going to be in time probably and then make a dog. We will see. But MBL eats huge walls. Purple is up. While well, MBL is going for a fast castle and conks. As simple as that. Keep doing villages. Yeah. He's going for conks. Here we are. With the malicious, he's gonna make some damage. But nay. He's trying to find the pocket. Ah. That's actually a really good idea. Even if he's not letting him cut or just be annoying. Ah, but nah. Okay. <laughs> well, they're water boys, guys. They're water boys. He has a dog and three fishing ships already there. Viper has, just look, guys, 29 villas already. Look at Viper population in comparison with everyone else feudal age. And seriously, can you tell me what Hira is doing with the Vikings? He's now going to make a dog. I'm gonna try to go Galleys probably. Double dog, okay. And here we are. With so much walls and now another palisade. There you go, MBL. MBL just click up feudal age now. Need to palisade as much as possible. And he's doing really quick. Spanish are also held for that. But now... He will have resources to go up to Castle Age. That's another thing. But only this is very easy to wall. He could make a house here. Or just wall in this area. And now wall. Yeah. But not with 4 millions, man. Just send 3 back. And that's it. Because now he's... Having... Some problems with... With the economy. I will make a second palisade here. If I was here. Seriously. Okay, that's gonna be a second tower that might be strong. He still does have the... Stick in the middle, man. Oh, wow. Man, that's so quick. 
That's really... Oh my god! Look how fast you killed it at the mill! It was... It was insane! 600 HP! It killed incredibly fast! Man! That, that, that's crazy, really! That, that really, really crazy! Okay! Oh, he's doing the tower! Now, and... MBL is doing a counter tower with the Spanish Billies. That tower, it probably won't go up. It probably won't go up, and if it's going up, it's gonna be so... Oh my god, oh my god, amazing! Amazing MBL! Amazing MBL, you need to wall! He wall it, and he's trapped! He's completely trapped, he's gonna kill absolutely everything! Yes, these deserve this! Destruction! Destruction from MBL doing an amazing job! Masterpiece taking the tower, killing the village, killing absolutely everything. Jordan is how to say in in, in, in Spanish, in English, in Universal. Jordan is fuck. You know, but he has one advantage. One advantage with Mr. MBL. And his advantage, it's clear. The fish. Five fishing ships with all the kills. Guys, with all the kills, he got three more villages still than MBL. But MBL is about to go Castle Age. While Jordan is about to go nothing. To go to nothing. Here, now, Hira is taking all the fish. Gonna take the dogs. Maybe not, because the Viper's castle is almost. Then, Tato is castle as well. But Teal, Heart, Aztecs. It's already almost in Castle Age. And that's amazing. A lot of villages on goal. Yes. Well, now, where is... Where is MBL? MBL, man. Should go up. MBL has the resources to go up. But he's missing something really important. Buildings. That he has the buildings? No. No wood. No nothing. Now the market. And I think the Blasmin is... Also needed that he doesn't have no wood. That's a problem because Jordan is starting to gather a lot of resources. Oh my god! But this is disaster! Because look at now Hira! Hira is gonna take all the fish from Jordan and Jordan is gonna be now completely bye-bye! Like, look at this! All the fish from Jordan into the damn hell! Yeah, he's taking absolutely everything. Hira is doing an amazing job. Obviously the Viper can now do something. Can definitely do something, but we need to see what the Aztecs is gonna do here. Aztecs heart got a lot of, lot of, lot of gold. Oh my god, he's already inside and taking village to Tato, going defensive. Now heart is going smoosh, smoosh, some, some monks. MBL now on the way to castle. He should have been faster, if you ask me, but you know, that's. What he sold or and what it is is different. Three dogs. Three dogs. Well, Hira is about to go up. Problem? Even if he got good amount of galleys. Now this is Yeah, fire ship man. Fire ships is just oh boy. Oh boy. Even a caravel. Even a caravel. Remember this Portuguese? The Viper can take the water? Probably. He can. Probably he can. But what about what about Mr. MBL? He's doing now a Lamar camp here to go outside, okay? But he's a stone wall. Oh my goodness. Look at the walls by Jordan. He definitely learned from uh, from Black Forest players. Here we are now. Siege Workshop, Aztec's Heart, and Monks, and Eagles. Everything. But guys, he's playing against Red, against Teutons. Teutons is one of the best to defend against the, the Aztecs, but let's see he wallet, so he's protected. He's a wall here too. Uh oh, he's gonna try. I guess the monks. Let's see the, the conversions. Yeah, it's a problem. It's Teutons, guys. Nah, he's not converting anything. Now look at Tato. What? What was that conversion? Just to make me look bad. What the fuck, man? How he converted instantly with Teutons bonus? I don't understand this game, seriously. I mean, I don't understand this game. It's disaster. But hey, the castle on his face. 
Now MBL 37 Billy, 37 Jordan as well. The castle is gonna happen now. Are you gonna make it? But you need you need a space to do it, Mr. MBL. Can you do it or not? MBL got the stone. In top of that hill. Why there? Well, I don't know. He's gonna want more. Wow. The scout is there. AFK and now doing an outpost. He's coming with a mangonel. I'm going to. Yeah. Oh, taking the outpost. He got the hill here. That's so important. Anyway, the Viper is booming. Two TCs and also good amount of galleys. Problem now is that Hira, that is in Castle, it is starting to make more and more galleys. And it's the Vikings with three dogs. So, eh, Hira is gonna be fine. It's gonna be really, really fine. Vikings economy also dominate. It's true that he has two TCs. So that will give him some really good boost for sure. But this is very interesting. Let's see what he can do. He need... Is he gonna make redemption? I don't know. Anyway, Spanish Kong is gonna go Petars? No. He's just breaking the walls. A couple of Petars. He should go probably Son. Not anymore. Not Petars because... He's in castles and now those stone walls are more HP. Should be fine. And... Oof. Oh, that was a beautiful, beautiful Magonet shot. He's still walling more and more. What to do here by Tantot? Honestly, towers. I mean, if you are Teutons and the bonus is there, Aztecs is so dangerous. So, Teuton towers. I mean, yeah, it's quite expensive, but they are amazing. They can put 10 villages inside. It's difficult to kill. But this push is gonna be deadly. Morville is going back. And Hart is doing an amazing job. He was doing this strategies a lot. Those Mongrass was doing this a lot on, on, on the Black Forest times. Ooh. Oh, fantastic. Really amazing. I think he deleted himself, but well. Doing another outpost. But why, why that far? Well, he's being careful. But you need to make Tom watch in this situation. Anyway, he's gathering more galleys and more galleys. And King Galleys from uh, Jordan uh, for Viper 17. I mean, he is gonna kill everything. And now Hart, listen to me, he's doing the tone watch. Yeah, he's doing the tone watch. More manger. He's gonna take the walls down quite fast. He is still walling, but Tato 60 villages. More villages, but no army. Only one army. 45 walls! Ay ay ay! With five mangoes, well, with five mangoes, the walls are going, still going to go down. Oh! oh! Ooh! He lost one mangonel, but he could have lost everything, man. He could have lost all the mangonels. Too really low HP. He got some lag. He's not repairing. He has to be really, really careful, man. What the hell? Okay. Now hit him, but you need to go in. Not gonna be easy. Coming with more spears, more monks. Complicated. And Tatot, it's gonna have what to defend? I don't know. He has no stone. No, no more stone to make a castle or something. You need to micro and... Beautiful, man. Seriously beautiful. The manga the shots. Well, now you can see how hard Hirasori is coming with a lot of galleys. More... Much more galleys than Viper. Viper is fully boomed. Yeah, it's booming completely, but he's gonna lose the water now. He's got more galleys. A lot more galleys. Well, on this area, amazing runs by MBL. He killed these two walls. And Jordan? Another good Black Forest player. Yeah. Three TCs, a lot of farms, and look at the walls. Amazing. But my question is... Uh, water? Why he's not doing Kongs? And he's sending the Kongs through this area. I really don't get it. But hey, it's his choice. Anyway. Now MBL is coming with the fire galleys. It's gonna help. Hira need to attack. MBL, what are you doing? What are you doing, MBL? He put in the middle. Well, thanks God that Hira is there. Then now he can, they can kill a lot. Yes, this is massive. This is actually massive. The Viper is still with 83 villages. But he's gonna lose absolutely everything. He should definitely do this 2 versus 1. Because now Jordan and Tatot both are used 
Fully booming. Fully booming. Doing towers. So Tatot is doing exactly what I told you. Towers. It's gonna it's gonna break a little bit more or not. Uh, 75 bellies. What I love it is that heart, like in the old times, is just attacking with look at how much siege, monks, spikes, everything. And it's still having a smooth boom. A nice and a smooth boom. Now the Viper lost everything. Gonna lose all the dogs. I don't know how they can come back here, here, but the way to come back is to have a brutal boom flanks, markets, and make trade. Because remember that most of the gold is in the middle. Here's only these piles, so they need to trade. They need to trade early if they lose the middle, and then try to come from uh, to come back from the land. You know, this reminds me a little bit chaos speed map that uh, you can go at the. In the outside and uh, and then trade but obviously in chaos speed is different because there's a lot of resources but here there's not so they need to think on that jordan is now on the way to imperial yes and uh, 83 villages mbl 75 villages he's gathering resources and look at green look at hira man it's amazing Viking's economy, he was castle, it's much, much slower than the Viper. And he's already up to Imperial with almost the same abilities and also 33 Navy. I don't know, this would be really a game for AM Tempo to win. But let's see, let's really see. Well, we have Viper with a lot of dogs. He's gonna try to go water. Purple is now going to water as well. But is, I mean water. <laughs> If you can consider this water. This this terrain is the water that important? Well, you get all the all the resources. And from there, with Cano Galleons, you can achieve almost everything. But guys, let's see. Because Teal is Imperial. And Teal is gonna make a castle here in top of that hill. An amazing castle. Send the eagles. No! No! Hart lose the castle because I'm Menstradamus and he lost the castle. Unbelievable! Let's go! And now he bought it. He bought it with all the gold, bought it another castle. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. He bought it. Look at the gold now from him. He bought it. He didn't delete because the stone wasn't there, okay? So he bought it another castle, okay? And right or not, you saw that the stone didn't go back. I was checking at the bottom right corner, and the stone didn't come back. But Tato is still there, trying to make a man on a shot. Didn't kill anything. I think Hart is doing an amazing game here, honestly. An amazing game. Here, he should still dominate, even if he lost the castle. We need to analyze. I don't know if you can clip it. If someone clip it, please clip it because we need to see it. We really need to see it. The castle just take the night. Don't kill more Bangones, man. What the hell? Okay. Here in this side, Hira is dominating. Really dominating. Chemistry now. The Viper is still zero army. Zero navy. Zero. Literally zero everything. Look at the castle in the middle. Now another castle. MBL almost imp. And guys, if his siege rams and halves kill his base, man. Ignore the water and kill his base. You need to trade. But with this push by heart, how to trade? You know? How we can see the buy buy resources. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at Hart. Hart bought it a lot of resources. Look. This is the buy both sold. You know? A lot. A lot by Hart. You know? So I'm sure he did it. He he lost the castle 100%. In my opinion. I don't know what you think, but I think so. Anyway. He's still with a castle here. He's in Imperial. He's gonna make a threat. He's doing Eagle Warriors. Eagle Warriors and Tatot is getting in Imp. If Tatot hold the first attack... The infantry from Teutons gonna be amazing. Really amazing. Tatot has 123 villages, but one army. And the Viper now four army. Four bombard cannons. Because they lost all the galleys. Really. You guys need to trade. And the Viper is gonna make markets here and trade. 
But in this spot, Portuguese bomber cannons trying to... Ay, 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 capture rage. La, 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 la. If my daughter and my son see this, they just gonna see invisible rams. Unbelievable. Okay, capture rage. I will go now to see because I want to see the army, you know? I really want to see the army. Let's put the normal score. It's the good thing that I have answers for everything. I don't want to, to miss anything. And we're going to see now the siege rams. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's really go. Okay, we will see less, but I want to see all the action. He's now trying to do infantry. Infantry plus one, plus one. The siege rams are coming. We have our and wood raiders, bombard cannons. Is MBL going to lose the game for his team or not? It looks like this. It looks that MBL is going to lose absolutely everything because he didn't wall at all. And now, how he's going to defend? Well, he's trying to go with the... Let's just zoom in a little. But... That he has an old army, MBL. MBL 27 army, Jordan 23. MBL is kind of holding. He's usually really good, but guys, Hart is trying to push on the right. He's trying to push on the right side, okay? Trying to push on the right side. Trebuchet, Bomber Cannons. Those Bomber Cannons, did he got the amazing upgrade? Ballistic for the Bombard Towers. Oof. Losing a lot. Man. Uh, Hart got no army. Hart got no army. He's trying to push, but got no army. He's now switching to infantry. He's lonely. Problem is that the Viper left the water. And now Viper is helping with Bombard Cannons in both spots. But here we are. MBL. No, this is Jordan. Was trying to make a castle and now he's being denied. They need to trade. Are they trading? They're trying. I restart Capture H and I put Capture H again or not? Okay. I will try. Now the sound is back. Those are the champions here. It's gonna be champions. It's gonna be champions. Well, yes, I want to capture H. Let's see if, if now it's gonna work. It's very annoying, but we need the data. We definitely need the data, but... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's put now the overlays again back. And hopefully don't disappear anymore. Who is this? Spartacus! Okay, MBL is now playing this really well. MBL 50 army with 104 billions. It's almost champions with hand cannoneers as well. They have plus two, plus two, but now champions by the Celts. He's playing well, but man. Gamer Legends is coming back. Gamer Legends is coming back. We see a castle, but now there's no more push. Crazy. And if they trade... If they trade, do they have trade, by the way? Did it, it works the trade here or not? Nah, the trade card is not working. Ah, there's a lot of books, man, sadly. Well, it's incredible, but you can see. They have the water control. And with the water control, they are dying, guys. They are dying because the Vikings is not helping our land. So, with the water control, they are getting killed. Because the Viper, that is a beast. Viper got nine bomber cannons with, with Archebus upgrade. Just look at this. Trying to go with bomber cannons, cannon cannons, and champions. He's getting champions, bomber cannons as well. He has to be really careful. He's trying to make the damage with those. MBL. To be fair, he's defending like a beast. Plays so good. What is Hart doing now? For now, nothing. Do I mean, nothing. He's doing champions now, but he can't push anymore. Those champions are with what upgrades? Completely fully upgraded. Garland Wars versus this tanky champion from uh, Teutons. I believe that Aztec champions are better. I think so. But 47 army, 46. Hard 13. 
he is dead. Now he's gonna go Arbalest, baby. Or try it. He's sending a lot of resources to each other. MBL is in huge problems. In huge problems. Now Hira is trying to move to both sides with so many archery ranges. And yeah, they control the middle. So they have a lot of resources to take. But if you lose all the farming, then you lose the game, obviously. Military numbers are so low for Hart. Viper don't have a lot, but he has the perfect army composition to help a lot. Oh, the Bombard Cannon, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, come on. Not anymore. Okay. But that Bombard Cannon is in the hell. There you go. He's losing, and now NBL keep losing more and more ground. Green need to be there fast. He has 200 population, Mr. Mr. Hira, but... To be honest, all that navy is useless, but seriously useless. You need to delete all those, otherwise he doesn't have room to make Arbalest, man. The Arbalest are fully abraded, I believe. Let's take green. Uh, yes, it has. Only missing one armor. Trying MBL now will have a lot of champions. Need to go with the Arbalest, but need army, man. Need army. This is two versus one. In this spot, a guy, look at the Viper, man. The Viper is just trying to... And then he's champions as well. We don't see champions so often. Oh my goodness. Yeah, bo the Bomber Cannons. Taking buildings. Oh, they, they, they are winning, guys. It's incredible, but... You see how the water... Is water... Overrated? It seems so, man. To be honest. They don't have the middle. They don't have the water. And they are just trading. And that's it. And it's game, guys. It's game. Honestly, Viper is so smart. I mean, as soon as he reached Imp uh, and lost the, the Gallus, instead of being a stubborn, he built Siege Wars up in both spots. You can see how Viper is in both spots. It's true that Hira now here, but I don't know if this is a node. Hira, well, with the Arbalest, might do a good job, but the Bomber Cannons are gonna help a lot. It's gonna try to hit, as you can see. And... Okay. Well, in the other side, it's also there with, with Arbalest as well. MBL guys, MBL and Hira, oh my god. Except Hart that is kind of low now in military, but MBL and Hira, a lot of farming. Now killing all the Bomber Cannons, amazing micro by Hira. Yes, Bomber Cannons behind, they are gonna take everything now. The Scorpions, heavy Scorpions. You need to kill the heavy Scorpions and he, they are killing. They're still going with the Champions. The army dropped it a little bit, but Hira is still now holding and holding and holding. The galleys, deleted, man. Those galleys are crap. Well... Cano Galleos might help. Ooh, Spiper going to come back today to do. No, he's focused on the land. He's definitely focused on the land because they were really close to the potential trade. But for now, M Tempo don't need trade. Why? Because they have the middle, so they don't need trade. But the others are trading a lot. But Viper is trading without caravan. Are you for real, Viper? Look, look at the speed from Viper. Look, look, look. <laughs> Bye bye, Tato. I see you later. Call me tonight. Okay. There is no caravan. So, those trade cards are not giving gold. Not giving gold. Water overrated, probably. Then, Arbales and Champions, they need hard to get more army. And now they are getting their military numbers from, uh, from Hira are great, but still, he got 37 useless galleys, 42 Arbales. That they are 20 on the right, 20 on the left. And that means. That is difficult to, to to dominate. And honestly, I would like to see more ramps by Jordan. Jordan resources are looking good. A nice wood, a nice food. Okay, gold. And he's trading. Guys, Tatot, Tatitot is doing Siege, Onager. No, it's Onager. Okay, I thought it was Siege Onager. Okay, okay, sorry. I wanted to see the, the big bada booms. And now, ooh, okay. Still taking the middle. I still think that water is not needed, honestly. I mean, if you have good trade, it's better. And then little by little, they will push more and more here. Oh, look at those arbalists, but the Ones are also there. Ay, ay, ay. Oh my goodness. How easy it is to kill the arbalists. And even if Hira got a lot, a great micro, they just destroy, destroy those arbalists. Here in this spot, the same. Look at the bomber cannons. Look, 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 look. Oh my god. Those Bomber Cannons with Arquebus is insane. Now he's bringing monks. He's 
going to convert the bomber cannon? Now finally, hard doing a good job. And no army at all. Siege Engineer, they are pushing back, at least in this side. They seem to be pushing back. Yeah. The Aztecs is dominating, but here, Jordan is just, together with the Viper, dominating. And remember one thing. Spanish got Spanish trade. They have Spanish trade and they are not trading. So, I mean, if they have the middle and they have a lot of resources, trade is solid. It's true that with many villages in the middle and not needed... E oh my god, look at those arbalists. They kill it with the bomber cannons. Completely. Yeah, Hira is losing a lot. Hira is losing a lot. And now they are pushing, I think... They only need to hold here. And holding here, that's it. Elite Wood Raider, guys. Elite Wood Raider. Killing more buildings. And guys, this is game. In my opinion, is game for Gamer Legends. GL. Oh, boy. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. You don't want to lose the bombards. Oh, beautiful now, Hira. Look at Hira. Look at Hira. Nice. Killing all the bombard cannons. That's massive amount of gold. Wow, but he's still coming with the siege rams. He's gonna push or not? He's trying to go and push. Siege ram, poo, 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 push. Yes, he's siege ram from Kelt. Unstoppable. In long run, unstoppable. Really, really unstoppable. Well, in this spot, look at how Tato is eating hard for breakfast. Well, almost dinner, but still. Ah! Yeah, champions. Sea Turners, but Viper is helping a lot with the Bomber Cannons, killing buildings, going with more and more, 137 villages. 137 villages, he got 58 farmers, while Heart 35, that's a huge difference for the long game. And now, even now, Tato is switching to Cavaliers, doing all the upgrades, because those Cavaliers are going to dominate. The game is over, they are not resigning, but I don't think so, the Gamer Legends can lose this game anymore. Definitely not. Yeah. And even without the middle. Problem is that Viking civilization is a it's not a great one to, to to help, you know. Hart is trying to trade with this market that is also invisible because they don't have. Yeah well the push is real and population is dropping dramatically. Dropping dramatically. Hazards. I mean, when you are going Hazards with the Spanish against Kelt, you know that you are dead. You know, like, like really dead. And he was without Furo Celtica all the time. Are you kidding me, man? Furo Celtica without Furo Celtica all the time? Yeah, it's a joke, man. And yeah, they're still here trying to push. They can't, but well, they are slowly, slowly. Okay, what is this bomber cannon doing here? Yeah, I don't know. There is some flashing. Why Why some TCs are flashing here? He's not getting damage. I believe that those TCs should, should flash if they are getting attacked or something. I don't know. Anyway. Oh. Those are good amount of Cavaliers and Arbalest. Now they can do some good job here. And uh, they are doing a good job. Yeah, but the Cavaliers are just dying and they are so expensive. I mean, if you look, ooh, but, but, but you need to, to save the bomber cannons. Nah, but they are saving, man. How about this, man? How about this? Is the way to go? Now with the bomber cannons, we'll, we'll attack or not? They are not micro in there now. What the hell, Viper? Now he lost everything. Disaster, man. Lost everything. Well, in this spot, they still hold him back. Still. Hard 38 farmers. He got good resources, actually. Four markets. And... They push back a little, man. They really push back a little. And look at now, more and more halves and heavy scorpions are coming. But in their base, that's the problem for them. They are still completely safe. I know that they are in the middle, but... But MBL has, right now, 13 Lambriacs, 20 farmers. He has almost 2,000 gold. But you need a lot more farmers. A lot more farmers. At least that he's getting a slim big time, you know? Because if that happens, he can even make paladins. And then, well, 
Palace and Arbalest combined is, is doesn't sound too bad. Oh, some upgrade in. Guys, Siege Onager upgrade from Jordan. Siege Onager upgrade from Jordan. Unbelievable. Really unbelievable. So you can check if Jordan has 146 villages, 51 are on wood and 34 are on foot. If that's, if I'm not too bad, that's like, well, 90 villages that he has 50 trade card. That's Jordan has 50 trade card. And Viper is still with a slow trade, you know? If the Viper had, yeah, man, 60 trade card, Jordan. Let me check because this is not working. Let me check it here to Jordan point of view. 44 trade card. What the hell? That's a lot. That's really, really a lot. Unbelievable. Seriously unbelievable. A lot. Anyway, they kind of hold a guy. Because now more army from uh, from AM Tempo. Yeah, and here we are with more champions again. The Viper is doing, in my opinion, a brutal mistake at the moment. Look at his village on wood and foot. Seriously, the Viper is not with Caravan. And the Viper has now Caravan in one hour game. Imagine the Viper resources if he got the speed. That's incredible. Incredible mistake with 173 villages. I told you. Look at now that, those Ferraris. You know? Those are Ferraris. Yellow. The Viper. AK Viper. Yeah, 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 yeah. Viper has till one hour. Look at the trade he has. 61 trade card going slow. You know? Unbelievable. Anyway. 61 trade card. Crazy stuff. Let's see now the Kells. <clears throat> Soon now, Viper will have huge goal. Will have huge goal, really. Do you see Viper goal very soon, okay? Remember my words. It's true that he's gonna use everything. He deleted villages now. He deleted some villages, need more bomber cannons. And it's about time. In my opinion, it's about... Oh! Is he... Are they going to cook? This is Paladins, man. NBL... Paladin and doing the Onegers is gonna is gonna is gonna could to raid, but he need to defend at home. I mean the rain is good, but if he's pushing, look at now heresy. I mean Jordan is doing heresy. Look at the resources he has. But Jordan, you need more army. 41 armies is not enough. You need to to, to have huge amount of army. Well now we have now the owner, Cav Rams. Now coming with champions, Arbal has a lot of farming. Where is that dot siege owners? No siege owners? Okay. And here is the push. They will try to cut? Yes. And they will. They, they are already cutting. There you go. And the parties are coming. Let's see if they're gonna notice. Let's see if they're going to notice. In the other side, in the north, we have heavy scorpions and house with bomber cannons. NBL is still not with the best population. I mean, it's okay, but not pop limit, and it's still ready here. I mean, this can be really bad. I mean, like, so much rating is... Oh, ba -ba -boom! What a time is bad! I know the boom! All the Arbalest from Hira in the hell. I like it, man. I really like it. Hira now dropping a lot of those archers, but he's still going. Still going with 64 champions now. Tatot, I don't know, but unable to make army. And here with the raiding, he's doing now a castle on top of that kill. The raiding is so annoying. All over. Right? All over. Kassar's all over. There you go. And in this spot, also losing a lot. The key is Jordan. Jordan here. Should just dominate. I mean, seriously. Makes you honors, man. Oh my goodness. Oh, the owners still disappear. <laughs> I can't with Capture H anymore. I'm sorry, but I can't go with, with disappear units because we are missing stuff and that's not normal. I'm sorry, guys. I prefer Capture H, but 
a, a version that this is good, you know? This is so much books and the units disappear all the time. Uh, I got annoyed. I'm sorry, guys. It seems that the 14 games is not working great. Anyway, more ammo is coming. Still, I'm gonna be casting properly for sure. I want capture age is better, yes, but it's a lot of books. Okay, it's still raining here. Now we see in this area, this is Paladins, Bomber Cannons. The Viper still doesn't have a lot of farming. Problem for Gamer Legends is that they don't have a lot of farming. Well, here on Heart, 80 army both. But this army is quality, man. Paladins, man. Paladins. Here, honestly, the Kells, uh, Jordan, should be able to dominate here against this army. It's few Hussars and Arbalets. So make some honors. Uh, other problem is that it's not gonna be gold forever here, you know? Like, I don't think there is a lot of gold anymore in the middle. And if they don't trade properly, it's true that trade here might be okay because they have a Spanish trade, you know? But sooner or later will be more and more complicated. Anyway, they keep trying to push. Not an oath. I mean, we don't see almost see honors. Why? I don't know. I'm going to Jordan point of view. <laughs> Look his resources, guys. Seriously. Look his resources. It's just... It's just insane. Look his resources. He has 50 trade cards. 2,400 gold. Wood. Just make corners, man. 200 population for sure. He's still raiding. And one thing that I forgot. There's not a lot of wood left. There's not a lot of wood left. Ay, ay, ay. Seriously. Okay. Just look at the wood, man. Disaster. Anyway, they keep pushing here. While in this spot, they are kind of stuck. There's a lot of wood in this area, but as you can see, right now, uh, Tatot is here just holding. Tatot resources, a lot of food, but not gold. So he can make sea chonners, which are really great as well. If you make sea chonners shot. Oh, sea chonners is there, man. He's there already. With ironclad. Oh my goodness. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Shoot, shoot. He can, but now he's a lot of farming. Yeah, well, they're raiding here, but is they raiding a node or not? Well, I don't know. I don't think it, it should be. But why so many ramps and zero owners? I don't understand. I don't know what you think, but I don't understand. No owners, man. Two ramps and champions. Now he's coming with the paladins, helps. It's quite a lot of farming, but with a couple of owner shots, you kill everything. But like this, what you kill? You kill nothing. What the fuck, man? And now they're raiding. Yeah, they're scalps all over and arbalets. Okay. In this spot, they are killing the castle. Now coming with the owners. More bomber cannons. They are pushing back again. Um, Hard needs siege on his own. Oh my goodness. Oh, the arbalets is again. Bye bye. Killing everything. The army quality they have now here. Not only the quantity, but Tato and Viper here has pure gold units. Paladins, champions, boomer cannons, and siege honors. It's, it's, it's a lot. Really expensive, but really strong. And on the left, in the top. Uh, boom, 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 boom. I don't think that now Jordan is playing great with the Kells. Honestly, I don't see your siege honors. He should make siege honors, keep a lot of house together, and advance with them, in my opinion, at least. And look at this. Archie ranges to be in the trade? That's amazing. But they notice. Great. Well, more planes and bomber cannons. In this spot, they are unable to advance. Come on, come on, come on. The owner, control, 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 control. Well, he can't. He's too far. And now, more owner is here. How about this? Jordan is still spamming. 4,000 gold zero loot. Balance economy for sure. Amazing. Now it's time to send the owners. Can you go and send it? Please, please, please. I want to see about the boom. Come on. Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. Open formation. Let's go, baby. He's gonna shoot again. Well, those owners are amazing, but he's sending a lot of farming. He's not getting the bada boom because MBL is there with a lot, a lot of paladins and Kassar. But those Calvardias from Kelts are just amazing. Really, really amazing. Now he can come. And if he don't pay attention, but he does because he split those units. Completely split. In the other spot, they hold, but I want to see the bada boom. The bada boom! No, it's not happening. And he's gonna do it. 
bonita la mierda. Hi, baba boom. Half of the arches are bye bye. The sichones are so good. The sichones. No, he killed it, but he's coming with another. I want to see the baba boom, 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 boom. Mierda, I fail, I fail, I fail. Forget that baba boom, I fail, I fail. No, I didn't fail. I see it before it happened, Ben Stradamus. Menstradamus, I hear, I see it before it happens. Menstradamus, amigos, I see before it happens. Ah, ah, well, well, well. On the right side, <coughs> stupid caster. Uh, champions, Paladins is gonna go with the trade cut, I don't know, but more honors. Do you see? Honors is what you need, a lot of honors on the right. And here, what are they doing? They're still raiding, completely. Raiding all the time. Raiding all the time. But still this push is so strong and soon they won't have gold. They won't have gold. I think they can't stop them anymore. This is good, but almost unable to dominate. And now Viper is coming with Village to do the castle. The castle is gonna be really good. They are defending well. And now the push from Jordan with the Kelt. It should be unstoppable. More siege. More ramps, kill the buildings, more halberdiers. Now the siege is in the middle, exactly protected for all the trash. Well, here they are fighting with a lot of units, but MBL is just dying. Problem here is that the bike is in Imperial is, how to say, in a nice way, pushing. Oh my goodness, another owner, man. And yeah, here are taking so many, so many shots, losing so many armorless, so many. And in the north, yeah, this is over. This is over now. They should resign, but they are not doing. But MBL, 97 villages, 30 are idle, 63 army. Yes, doing a castle here. They have all the map. And the Kells domination. More Pala. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, they are trying to call here, but now Viper is just holding in the middle. Oh, they are losing all. They are losing all here. This is useless. And yeah, well, here are still with a lot of galleys on the water. Useless as well. More bombard cannons, and now they will call the GG very soon because it's over. They don't have trade, they are doing an amazing job here, they are cleaning MPL from the walls, and the population is 150 or below for all AM tempo. While Gamer Legends have 200 pop Viper and Jordan, Tato a little bit less because his army is more expensive, but doesn't matter. They are going to take this third game that went into really late game because Game of Legends didn't got the middle but they got the trade we will see guys the incredible trade they have now they're killing absolutely everything please resign there's no more trade thank you hard to listen to me and the game is over GG well played amazing game so far in this one by Game of Legends without the water they just dominate back and the water is just overrated amazing really really amazing hopefully you have enjoyed try my best with the casting my voice is still on point on fire military here are 93 largest army and useless the unit killed by tato the insane 1353 because he got crazy and beautiful units the viper 67 he lost the least units as well because he got also the most bomber cannons and well range units jordan lost a lot of units 69 largest army is lovely and build a lot of army too and hard but check the economy the economy says well that the viper <laughs> the viper got thirty-eight thousand trade 38,000 trade without caravan imagine imagine with the caravan of an upgrade what he will get seriously he will get crazy i mean amazing really really amazing trade you know so and the viper gave some resources the viper gave 32,000 resources to tatot pretty much i mean he gave 30k resources to tatot 30k resources to tatot but mbl got 40 thousand resources Hira is linked 55k what the hell but MBL and Hira amazing trade in the game Zero.
We love this game. Here we are, game number four. Game number four, you can go for the bettings. This is starting and it's gonna be what? Let's go, amigos. Game number four and a step start. What? What? Flaming Camel is exploration. You gotta be kidding me. Flaming Camel. For real? Oh boy. Oh really boy. Everyone got a Flaming Camel, I believe. Yeah. Well, it's what it is, amigos. It's really what it is. Okay. Well, they are going to explore incredibly fast. This map, as you can see, I will keep this because capture rate is failing quite a lot. Hopefully you don't mind. And with 2v2, there is not a lot of data, so we are just fine. There is quite a lot of snow here. I think they can build. This looks lovely. But in the minimap, we cannot see the snow, actually. No, no, no. You cannot. And they started with quite some village, right? Population is strong already. And civilizations they have here are Leary, Lithuanian. Oh my god, Lithuanians and Mongols both. Okay. But are they gonna use. Are they gonna attack villiers? They have 20 attack. They can make up the boom, right? <laughs> okay. What? When you stop, it's, it's, it's chilling? I didn't know that. I never see those units. So the flaming camel, look at this, it's chilling. Chilling activated. Uh oh, do you see? No. No, no, no. Hira. Oh, it's limbing. Interesting. Okay. Oh, what the hell? And he got lame still. <laughs> Look at that. He lose the flaming camel. And he's... Oh. Okay, shut up, man. Today is not your day, man. But he took one, one ship back. Um, and then... My question is... Is worth it to lose the flaming camel that early? I think it's good to have. You might explore a lot. So I know that might be annoying, but uh, well, let's see. Uh, let's see what the strategy they're gonna pick. We have the Viper with Lithuanians facing Liri, that is with Mongols. He has four villages on wood. By the way, I don't have the Ultra HD graphics. I need to put it there again. Or you want... It's 2v2. I'm gonna try Capture H again. I mean, let's try. Come on. Let's try, guys. It's good to have Capture H, honestly, but... It's, it's the problem is that it's annoying in late game. It's, it's, it's beating... Yeah, it's beating bad. And now I have to change this the score again, too. Yeah, because Lear is one player that wasn't in the first game. So you need to change the score. Okay. Okay. No, damn, this is the L. And this is AM Temple. Okay, guys, sorry. Yeah. This is the bad thing, and now. The, the first game was for GL and AM and then GL. This is the score. Okay, let's see what they do now. Yellow and red. I mean, everyone going up. Blue is going to be the faster, that Hira. It's going to go stable. Probably Lee will go archers. Yeah, stable in the house. Let's go. Good resources for everyone. Yeah, sometimes in those non-start to see people going fast caster, kinda 
Kinda too much. Oh. Oh, come on. These guys know all the tricks. All the tricks. And as you can see, the sound. Oh my god. I also need to. Need to stop the sound in the background because you listen to these sounds. It's a lot of things that they need to really change because you cannot be all tap all the time when you need to change some some options, right? I don't know what you think, but Okay. Um Here is coming with the scout got a spear. Now he's going archie range. I mean the Mongols going archers, that's normal. Yeah, and Viper here with the scouts, okay. Well, Leary has already two archer ranges. Just look at the difference. Leary has already two archer ranges. The Flaming Camel... He really killed... With the Flaming Camel, he just took a ship. Wow. He's doing forging. He's going really aggressive with this. Wow. Yeah, and now he's gonna pick two villains from Doubt. Doubt playing today very sloppy, to be honest. Yeah, well, he lost... Avalier there. Now what is Viper doing? Oh, Lear is coming already. Lear is coming already with the arches. That he has fletching? No, he has no fletching yet. But those three arches and a spear are always very annoying. He sent... I don't know if you have noticed. He always sent some arches and one spear very fast. And here, the relics... Elephants in the middle of the map. Oh, so many relics, okay. Well, let's see if this game is gonna go for a long game. I'm not sure about that. I mean, I feel that with these crazy walls, there's gonna be a lot of aggression very soon. Leary has right now 10 army. The Viper 6. And Leary is going right away to kill Doubt. Yeah, man. As simple as that. Now he's walling at home. We'll have some army to defend. And if we go together with Hira, this is going to be a quick game. Viper is coming with the scouts. Okay. Not a quick game. Viper is playing properly. And now they are trying... Ooh, Viper. Ooh, the Viper with the bloodlines. Amazing. Amazing. But... He noticed now that his bloodlines. Pro oh my god, Leary. It's taking now from Doubt. How to say this in one word? Everything. Doubt 3 army. 3 army Doubt. Leary 10. 3 villains more. But Doubt. It's on the way to Castle Age. Yeah. He got to Castle Age super fast. But without army. Leary is about to be there. He has good resources. And then if they go attack now the Viper. Viper is going to be in big problems. In big, big problems. Honestly, going that fast to Castle it is, in my opinion, kind of tricky. And now he's going to be doing Mago Dice. Yeah, but then Viper need to hold here. Need to hold here. Leary is about to go up to. He got good foot for sure. He mined a lot of gold. And Leary is not going to go Mago Dice. He's going to go full crossbows. The good thing is that with the crossbows... You're gonna have a lot more production. Obviously, the mobility is limited, but let's see here the battle. That's a scout with bloodlines, and oh my god, those scouts got all the upgrades. Viper doing an amazing job here. Really good job by the Viper, but he's gonna be an oath. He's gonna be an oath. Uh, I think he's gonna be close, but Viper is just taking the battle here because he got bloodlines plus one and plus one. That's why he's far away from going up. Far away from going up. So, it's worth it this. Now Viper sacrificed a little bit himself. It's true that he didn't lose any villier, if you ask me. Any villier at all. But green and blue both are on the way to Castle Age. And this? 12 villiers on berries? You have to, you have to fix that, amigo. You have to fix that. He has another Lambrican. I like it. And let's see if Green is going to make even another Archie range. I don't know. Now he's holding and waiting. Waiting for the Castle Edge. Well, Castle here by doubt. 
Magoda is are so damn amazing. Obviously, he will need to mass a lot. Mass a lot of Magodais. He doesn't have even a, a stable. And that has 30 villains. His economy is, in my opinion, total trash. Like you can see, no food at all to make the upgrades. No bozo, no nothing. Right? And obviously, no botkin arrow yet. He has no economy. He's gonna make a TC here. That's a good town center. Fish? I mean, honestly. I mean, you see this map and then, and now you see fish here. I ah, come on. N now, seriously. L let's make the maps. They are good maps, cool maps to watch, but stop putting fish in the middle of nowhere. Seriously. <sighs> Put fish in my, in my place, man. Oh my goodness. Thank you for following. Okay, look at Lily now coming with a lot of crossbows. A lot of crossbows. Thank you, man. Omago444. Thank you for, for joining the party. Now the Mago Dice has plus one. And those lot of crossbows. He has no ballistic yet, but he's so many crossbows. Where is the Viper? Viper is still in feudal age. In feudal age, the castle is there. Okay. Okay, they are going together with knights and crossbows. They need to make damage because if not, the Magundites. Oof! The Magodice can do here a lot of damage. If he's finding this, he's gonna make a lot of damage. Look at those, but he's not finding. And now, a lot of economy idle for Doubt. That's the problem. Doubt has 42 villiers. This is an amazing TC here. Yes, but now he's moving, the, moving all over. I don't know. I don't really know. Like, if he's not doing damage, Doubt is gonna be so behind in the economy, I think. Now Leo is doing is doing cab archers. I like that. That he has uh, bloodlines. No, has the husband? I don't think so. He has either. Now they can raid together. They're being much more connected. You can see how right now in this game here and Leo are being much more coordinated. And Leo only missing the ballistic. If he's going with ballistic, if he's doing ballistic, he's gonna be in a better position. Obviously, it's expensive. He's doing siege war shop. And university as well. But that he has the resources to make ballistic? Not yet. The thing is, the idle time from Daud is massive. It's really, really massive. He's trying to attack. Okay. How many relics got? Hira. Two relics, Hira, guys. And he's with Lithuanians. That's a lot. That early is really, really a lot. Nah, he's killing a lot now. Uh, Daud is, is dead. I mean... He's not dead, but just look at the village difference. They, I mean, and now with Ballistic, just going to dominate. It's really risky. It's true that now he's coming with a lot of Magodais. He's gonna take the monk, okay? 
He's still without the ballistic. He's coming out with the Mago Dice. He's still raiding. He's trying to raid. That's the good thing. But he reacts super fast. Uh oh. Another relic he's gonna lose. Another monk he's gonna lose. And doubt not this. Oh, taking the Severus. Yeah, he's not he's not doing any damage to Viper. But he has three TCs as well. Now let's see now the the Cav Archers. He's gonna be able to do it. He has ballistic. Uh oh. Uh oh, Hira, Hira, no reaction now. And now those Cav Archers we will see. Ballistic. Ballistic will help a lot. It will help a lot. He got some heal advantage, taking some villains, doing a good job now, doubt. Definitely a good job. But now he's not doing a good job. He's sleeping. Sleeping and now he's raiding. Now this game this game is total domination. Like like total domination. From uh from uh from Leary and Hira. Look at the score difference. They are not resigning, but the game is over since the strategy. When I saw the strategy, I said don't like that strategy, you know? Don't like that strategy. Look at this. He's gonna lose all the Mago Dice now. So many crossbows, so many cap bars. This is this over, man? I mean, he's losing absolutely everything, man. Absolutely everything. Now he can lose the villains. He's only two tone center, three tone center for Leary. Nothing they can do now is a little bit painful. And in the, at this point, when the difference is a thousand score different as a team, a second castle don't gonna solve anything. Doubt castle in the house. If Lear is going, if Lear is just going now, oh boy. And now Lear just need to go. The Magnus are coming because he wasn't too greedy. But if he was going, he will deny it and kill absolutely everything. Let me check. What? Where's the sound? Game ended. Now, now I is explaining what where's the sound. Total destruction, guys. Total destruction. There is nothing they could do in this game. I say it, and I think well, it was pretty clear why that uh, well, the strategy. Even if doubt got castle, sixteen minutes. It's going too fast. Castle it naked. No army. You have to make the castle, and then you have to mine a stone too early what that means you don't have any economy so then you fall really behind in villages just look how he was 20 villages behind 20 villages behind and then it forced viper to make so much units so viper went castle is much slower than the others guys 2-2 two, two. uh sadly a very one-sided game let's go back There you go, guys. This is game number five. You have two minutes to make bettings. And now we are going to start. It's going to be... Let, let's, let's see. Arabian Omelette. We are starting. We are loading the game. And we are getting absolutely there. And let's see. Because it's loading. Yeah, we are connected. And how it is this game? Let me check, amigos. Arabian Omelette. Let's put the sound. And, well, it's just Arabia with uh, some hills and resources in the middle, you know? But here, the, the meta is gonna be similar like Arabia. Pretty similar like Arabia for sure. We have MBL Hard Leary and uh, Jordan Islam Doubt. I'm going to change obviously the chat because now again we can see the statistics not here this one perfect and uh, again the capture age makes oh reset again so much play all seven i mean this is so annoying that they have to change the scoreboard every single game when they change the players you know all right, let's put one, one, two, two. That's it. It's not the order how they want, but doesn't matter. Anyway, as a pocket, we have green player. With what? With Frank's heart. Then yellow, doubt, as I told you, is Frank's as well. On the left or in the south, we have Ethiopian Islam facing Mayans NBL. On the right side, Britain's Jordan versus... Britons Leary, both Britons. 
Well, let's see Liri against Jordan. Jordan is playing a lot. How good he's gonna play as a flank? We will see. We will see. But in my opinion, Liri and Biel and Hart should be a little bit favorite here. It's true that Doubt Pocket is amazing. I mean, I think this is his best role. 14 games, Doubt Pocket is, is definitely strong. Beast. Beast mode, I would say. I don't know what you think. Then as a flank, Islam is always very solid as well. And Jordan, obviously is good. But when you're facing Leary, you start to get worried, right? A little bit at least. So, let's see how they will play. Hart as a pocket, he was always his best role as well. Remember that Hart was like a Black Forest player, you know? And now, uh, well, now he's uh, playing every map, but you feel like he dominates more as a pocket, you know? Better than Feudal Age Aggression. Anyway, four villages on wood for MBL. I will, I will go just probably to catch up a little bit fast forward. Now, let's see. Let's see what they are going to do. Resources. Let's zoom out a little bit. I mean, there's a lot of wood. It's possible to wall. He has gold at the back, stone, berries on a side. But very easy to wall, if you ask me. Yeah, all the maps look quite easy. I don't like this lumber camp. Why here? Just make the lumber camp here. Pali said, now this is more, more difficult to, to protect. But well, maybe he did before explore. This lumber camp for doubt is amazing. You wall this area and that's it. And as a pocket is different. Let's analyze the flanks better. Two goals at the back, two a stone. Map from Jordan, amazing. Really good. I mean, with all that at the back. And Barry is very close to the TC. Fantastic. While Leary, well, it's a spread all over. Goal at the back, one goal on the right side, another goal in front. Well, but it's still, it's wallable. It is okay. Honestly, okay. Um, the pocket will go quite fast, as you can see. Look at this. He's going up with 19 population. 19 population hard. Doubt is going up. 21? Wow. Two villages is, lo uh, is lower. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's palisading. And... Okay. To get the ostrich. Well, he need to wall. I mean, it's a must. They will wall. And more even the pocket. Because if you get raided as a pocket, you are dead. Now I'm checking and... He really need to wall even more. Because look at the goal from Doubt. All four were in almost the same spot. Terrible if he get doubled. Really terrible if he get doubled. Uh, for now, not a single player going for trash. They are going directly archers. Leary, archer range. What? I mean, this is very bad. Ready, mandatum. Look at the look at the village he's sending to the archer ranges. If he imagine that the other player was there with the scouts or or militias, not even men at arms. Bye bye, both villages. It's surprising that, well, he got all the villages really low HP. So, <laughs> okay. Anyway, zoom out a little bit. Double IG range as well. And guys, you can see GL pliers already fully wall purple, fully wall yellow. Not not yet, but doing. And red on the way. Oh, it's still very open. Levi is also walling as well. And with buildings, it's still less and uh, less wall. I mean, they're open still. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Look at MBL guys. Look at MBL walls. I mean, Archie Rains Barak in front. Then look at the wood. He has goal. He make a mini base. Amazing. Really, really amazing. Then he will have the farmers and he's fine. Just taking the berries. One is a stuk. You have to be really careful with those villages stuk, you know? Yeah, there you go. And the ostrich are close to the mill, so. Really nice, those walls. Anyway, Leo is going quite fast. Like we all will know. And he's going probably to the pocket. Or not. 
We will see. Doubt is also on Jordan's side. Okay. And Lily is going directly to Doubt. But Doubt is fully wall. So, no problem for him. He's starting to wall because they notice how they are walling absolutely everything. This one will down. No, Leo will lose the scout. Okay, he's saving. No, he didn't take it. Almost, but didn't take it. He lost it. Now the two arches and a spear and... Okay. Well, he, he's fully walled, so no problem. Already going for the gold. In minute 13, going already for the gold because he has quite a lot of farms already. But they are walled completely. Where is MBL? Trying to attack as well. And at home, well, the hunters are kind of exposed. Let's go fast to his point of view. Let's see right now what MBL can see. Is he gonna... Yeah, fast reaction. Fast reaction, but that's the problem. All the food now is in the hell for him. Well, his arches... Pfft, this is so annoying. Look how far it is. He need to go back with those arches. Look how far they are. Yeah, man. He, if he explore and go here, it will be much better. It's not gonna be in time. The arches are just going... so far, really. Yeah, what a pity because, yeah, but, well, I mean, psh, he was a, he was super close. And now just look, that's waste time. Of course, he's gonna try to come here to this area. He has more army. He's gonna try to trap him, but isn't worth it better to go here? Probably it is. Now Green is inside because he didn't wall yet. That's surprising hey. for Jordan. Everyone is wall except him. Well, Leary, what is Leary doing? Where's Leary's army? I don't know. I don't see them. But now. Purple will lose everything, because this is a good sandwich. And those oh. archers will be gone. He's trying to get the hill. He's now coming with more units. But, ooh, you need to play properly, MBL. And I don't know if he's doing right now. No, no, no. I don't think he did a great job there. Slam out micro him pretty nicely. I don't know if you agree, guys, but I think Slam definitely out micro him big time. Even with the hill advantage. No, no. I think Islam is doing an amazing job here. He's taking absolutely everything. Look at that one. And now, okay. He's forcing him to go back. Islam is doing the job. Taking all. Taking a lot more than MBL. Now he's going to be fine because he sent Reigns forward. But yeah, yeah. He's, he's good, man. He's a good micro by Islam. He's a really nice one. Okay. And force him to make a third RT range. Trying to micro more. And at the end, of course, he cleaned, but he is still now at home. Anyway, he's with Ethiopians. Probably those shooting archers faster helps about that. Eh, Leary? What is Leary doing? You kidding me? Leary, click up castle it in 18 minutes. It's disgusting. I mean, seriously disgusting. 14 farmers. 14 farmers. How many Lambriax? Six here. Another seven in the other one. Thirteen. Then eleven villages on goal. And he's on the way to Castle H incredibly fast. Red is going to go up. But guys, look at also Doubt. Doubt is in Castle H. 18 minutes. As a pocket amazing transition to Castle H. Yes. He has to be careful. Green will be there. He's doing the market. But small mistakes will matter here. A lot. Now, yellow is with red together. And, uh, I don't know. I mean, guys, uh, with Saint Civilization, Leary has 39 villages, 27 army, a lot more army than Jordan, and he's up to Castellage over a minute faster than him. To be honest, I don't know if you agree, it's an insane transition really a really good transition to castle age he's missing the horse collar jordan as well so he's missing some uh, good upgrade and now those amount of archers with the botkin arrow and crossbow upgrade are just going to dominate don't think 
Don't think that Dal will have enough knights to defend. Here with the archers, he can deny all the Labriacs. Really, snipe them all. He can go inside as well. This is just crazy, really. He's coming with the, with the scout and one knight. It's Wally Moore. And yellow is just going to, 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 to heart. So that's, well, brutal. Slam and... Uh, Slam and... Uh, and MBL. Four villains difference. The time up is almost the same, but the slam got Will Barrow, so pretty much the same. Really close. But here we are. Lear is going to go and uh, dominate Jordan. He has Botkin. Oh, really? Now he's gonna have... How many villains? One down, two down, and no ballistic is disaster. Because you can see how he could, he could have killed a lot more. But he's now going in with so many crossbows. I don't know if Green will jump there with some knights, but Jordan eats... About to be dead. He got 41 army. No, 34 army, sorry. 27. He's there and trying to kill the units before. Before. Yeah. I mean, look at the score. Difference is insane. More villages, more army. Now he's going to take some villages and the gold miner Jordan is dead. I mean, seriously dead. This one is disaster. Really disaster for Jordan. And... You can see how one minute when the civilization is the same mirror is it's just terrible, man. Really terrible. Anyway, he has to be careful. Now he's doing a gate. That's still deleted because he's gonna lose a stone. And where's MBL? Yeah, he's coming with more crossbows. It's, it should be fine. Might lose some. But I need to focus in this area. Because Jordan now and Doubt need to do the job. Jordan can't do the job. Why? Because Leo got ballistic. And that's huge. I mean, if he's moving fast with ballistic, with Britain's ballistic, he's just insane. He's doing now the university. But Jordan has resources to make uh, ballistic? No. He has no goal. That's the problem. I mean, Jordan has no goal. Look at the bear. There's a lot of items from him. And let's see. Because now need to save the Lord. The Lord need to save Jordan. Right now... Is a big problem. Uh, well, Jordan 38 villages, 20 army guys. Well, 40 Leary now is just. Well, it's the problem with those games. Like one battle, and I mean, the score is not that huge different in total, but you feel like what Jordan can do in this game now is gonna be bigger and bigger difference. Because the green is just sending more knights, and now it's impossible. That's why Mirror. If there's a one battle with mirror shifts, you can't come back. You know? I mean, if it's a 3v3, because blue and purple will take a big battle there. And they're going to be more or less okay. With 54 villages. More villages from him. I mean, also more army. So, right now, MBL is ahead to a slam as well. And, uh, yeah. Disaster, guys. Why he's not sending the knights to attack? I mean, Lee is killing all and he's killing the walls. Makes sense. Makes sense, Gart. Gart! Oh my god. Gart, man. Seriously? Okay. Well, Leary, Leary is still killing all and he's attacking the Palisades. Makes sense to me. I don't know what you think, guys. Look at this. Okay, now the Palisades are break, are broken. You can break more. And now taking more villages. Incredible, man. Incredible how Leary has destroyed Jordan. Seriously. I mean, a speechless. Really a speechless. Hart is also with 10 villages more. 10 villages more. No, it's, a, it's 6 villages less. Better say it. Uh, Doubt has 25 army. And what is Doubt going to do? He's going to attack Leary at home. Right? Well, he need to do something like this. Because Jordan is completely dead. Leary, it's not wall at home. So he can lose a lot. He can now lose a lot. Oh boy. Sending all the knights. So then, maybe go and attack uh, Doubt. Well, Doubt always... Oh, no, man. Okay, well. Doing the market. This is so crazy amount of archers. And well, okay. 
Okay, it's many knights. It's true that Doubt got many knights, but he's gonna be together with Heart. So let's see. Nah, th this is over, guys. It's impossible. Look at the score difference. It's, it's, it's really big right now. Wow. I mean, 44 villages, 22 army Jordan, 63 51. The total population difference is insane. It's double the army, it's 20 villages more. While pockets now are similar 79 villages, 24 army, 31. Yeah, Doubt has a lot of knights. But then, Slam and MBL almost the same villages. Well, is MBL want to go up to Imperial or, or what is he doing? Why two TCs? He should have more tone centers. I don't know. Well, he wall. He wall a little here. He's trying to attack. Now Reds will go, but he can't. Yeah, Doubt got a lot of army. But he can't really kill. Yeah, he can't really kill. You can see how Leo has 1,000 foot. He can make a castle if he wants. He has 500 stone even. And where is Red Army? Oh my god. Blue is here, MBL is here. Are you kidding me? Oh, what is MBL there? What is MBL there? Um, Islam will put a problem to, 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 to MBL, in my opinion. Islam is having, again, a brutal game. Seriously, a really good game. Because he's about to click up to Imperial. And Doubt, with 89 villages and 32 armies on the way to Imperial. Oh boy. Oh really boy. Leary is on the way to Imperial as well. Solid. 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 Slam is up. And now Slam can destroy MBL. He's gonna make a castle in the Omelette. Yes, but Islam with full armor and rams can just kill everything to MBL. MBL is so far away from Imp. I don't know what he's doing with two TCs only. And with two TCs only, he's unable to go up to Imp. I don't get it, really. Anyway, Jordan is dead, but Doubt and Islam is still able to carry. It's true that Green. It's also going to Imperial with a lot of knights. 27, but look at Doubt. 39 knights. 39 knights is a lot. Really, really a lot. But the problem is the amount of army from Leary. The kid will have a castle here. And if he's doing gentlemen, oh my goodness. He got 61 Arbalest. Britons Arbalest. Nah, it's so difficult. So difficult. And Biel still have zero gold. He has. He has zero villages on gold. What the hell is he doing? Like... MBL is not mining gold. I don't get it what he's doing, really. I mean, if Islam played properly, he should have a massive advantage with MBL. The problem is, they need to go together. Seriously together. Now, doubt is coming, but this is... 2 versus 2 in this one. Got the heal advantage. And I insist. Need to wait Islam Imp. Wait a little. Get into the hill. The problem is... <laughs> Jordan is joining the party, yes. But Leary is coming. Leary is going with a lot of archers. Yeah, a lot of archers. And he's gonna go to attack Doubt. He has to be careful. Because Doubt can't really dominate, I'm telling you. Can't really dominate. And Bial is still without any gold. Any gold. He got the foot to go up. Yes. 1,400 foot. Come on, MBL. Go up, man. Sell. Sell. Yeah, but now... I mean, he's out of the game. Jordan is out of the game. Look at this disaster. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. He's still going together, but now... If Islam and Doubt play properly, they can kill MBL. MBL is not Imp. MBL got 27 army. And this is Arbales. No, why he's doing chemistry? All the armies are no Arbales. I don't get it. I don't get it. He's gonna be a Doubt Castle. He's gonna be a Doubt Castle. He's so many archers. He's gonna be a Doubt Castle. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can make this castle. This is disaster for MBL. Disaster for MBL. But Leo is trying to go. They have to be careful. Those Arbales, but Arbales now Paladin upgrade. Paladin upgrade. Elite Lombos by Leary. Paladin upgrade. 
for doubt while Hart can make Paladin upgrade too. He's doing the Paladin upgrade as well. Let's go. But this is scary what Doubt can do. Doubt 49 army, 100 failures. But but Hart the same, man. So Hart is doing a good job too. You can see how he's there raiding. You know what is the best here? Is that they are letting Jordan to recover. Jordan has 86 villains now. So he's kind of recover. But Green here is a stopping a slam completely push. And in my opinion, he should be... Doubt should be together with the slam. Was the only chance for them to dominate. Then he went alone, tried to raid the pocket, but slam needed to be here. Sorry, Doubt. Bad decision by Doubt, in my opinion. Was risky. Yeah, he's raiding a little, but... Stonewalling. Uh oh. Yeah. If he's not breaking in, but he is open. He is open. He need to go in and kill the pocket probably. But that's not happened. And now Slam lost everything. That's the game. Well, Leary is here with so many archers attacking Doubt. Doubt 89 villains. 89 villains while 120 uh, 28. Problem? Is that now? Oh my goodness! All the paladins on Leary's base is gonna take a TC and gonna kill everything. All the villains. Where's the paladin from? From Hart? Nobody knows. But he is still attacking, attacking Jordan. The paladins from Hart? I don't know. But now Leary, look at Leary villains and population. Whoa! -ho -ho! Leary population. Drop it dramatically because the lord is doing a massive destruction on the kid while heart now need to clean problem is that slam need to recover a little bit the army but it's still a lot more villains it's incredible guys it's incredible how one decision here can change the game he still have 54 paladins with 96 villains but 54 paladins. Crazy stuff. Crazy stuff. Now Jordan is on the way to Imperial. I mean, they are 2 versus 3 for for a really long time. And now Islam it's going to kill MBL. Like, he got Darbal as a note to kill. He needs Siege. Those are Chivari. What? He was without Chivari heart? That's a big problem. Blue March is okay. But just look how behind was Jordan. Now Leary, 69 villains. It's ridiculous. How many, how much economy he has lost. Crazy. But now, the thing is that Leary only need wood and gold. So he go Lombos. They are elite Lombos. Still, military numbers. And the most important here, the economy from heart is untouched. 138, and now he's spamming Paladins forever they still need to raid and he's raiding man he's really raiding so he doesn't let jordan to get in the game jordan is still 74 villains the same now that leary after leading leary got 40 paladins on his base but guys where is islam islam is in the middle now hard is here with the paladins and now islam again is gonna get a sandwich but that castle gonna save him a little bit nah they kill all they kill all doubt Still doing an amazing game. With 60 paladins in the middle. Killing a lot. Where's, where's Hart? He's out of position all the time. He's gonna kill a lot again. Hart need to come and kill now all those paladins. Still. The advantage is not huge in this score, but I believe it, it is important. Because now Hart is gonna kill again Jordan. Jordan, 78 villains, but they still have more army than Leary now. Obviously not the stronger units, because as you can see, those are elite Lombos, but then we have Blue Marches. Blue Marches versus Arbalest. Who is winning? Blue Marches. But there's a lot of Paladins. He needs to go back. Paladins coming from hard as well, going all together. As I told you, Doubt and Islam could, could hold the game for a long time, and they are doing. They are really doing. But Leary, 80, 80 villains, 31 army. Well, look at the numbers, man. Look at the numbers. 
is very similar in military for both teams. The problem is that Jordan still getting raided like crazy. Wow. Yeah, now Jordan is 60 bullets again. They keep going. Still. Doubt economy kinda struggle now. You see how Doubt got zero gold. Well hurt. Also, 60 farmers, 55 population. Still more army for, for Doubt. Oh. <laughs> he hit the elephant with the paladins. He got some heal advantage. Need to be careful. And where is Hart again? Oh my god. Where is Hart again? I don't know. Where is the paladin from Hart? Oh baby. Hart paladins. Can you tell me? Jail me now. Those lobos. Insane. Okay. Seize ram from Slam. He's able Slam now to dominate the middle. We will see. So many paladins from Hart again. 59. 54. The trade is going to be needed. Are they gonna trade? Not yet. There's a lot of resources in the middle. And wow. So many, man. So many pala in the skill. Still, the problem is that Jordan doesn't have the numbers, and Leary still have 63 lead lumbos. And taking the trash. Amazing. Blue Marches, this battle is might be the battle of the game. Battle of the game incoming or not? Look at the Lombos. Blue Marches, man. Where's, where's MBL? Go. Wow, look at that. What the hell? Hart seems to... Oh, but Hart is raiding all over. That's something that in the long run, it's it's going to pay off for sure. And now the game is absolutely over. Doubt couldn't carry anymore. Has been a huge advantage from uh, from really from the start. Was a really good attempt from Doubt that was trying to, to kill someone. He did a lot of damage to Leary, but Leary recovered quick. And with the lead Lombos, and now Plume marches, 55 army, 15 army, Doubt is out of resources, and also getting raided constantly. While if you check the minimap, Hardys never get raided. Oh my god, this Slam got a lot of army as well. Lot of army. Is those the lead Plume marches fully raided? Yes, it is. But now, no army from Doubt, and uh, very nice game to watch. I think it was over a long time ago. They tried because Doubt and Slam, well, pure legends. But Leary, in my opinion, I don't know if you agree, guys. Um, MVP of the game. Like, he just killed Jordan completely, man. Amazing play by the kid. Amazing play by the kid that came and suddenly both games that he played, AM Tempo, won pretty clear. Pretty clear and uh, total destruction, guys. Total destruction. In this one, Viper wasn't there, but in the previous one, it was. So, ay, ay, ay. That was a great game. Nice gameplay. Well, it wasn't a great game. Game because it was, in my opinion, killed too early, you know? But was very nice performance by several players, you know, here. 3-2 uh, for AM Temple, okay? And now, statistics. Military, we have... Uh, NBL 97 Larry's army. Look at the army he got at the end. Well, Mayan's cheaper units. But then, Leo 82. Jordan maximum 43 with Britons, the same. He lost a lot because Doubt killed it a lot. Slam is still killed the most in the game. And uh, honestly... Well, they, the problem is that they try and kill Leary as well. It's hard to say. Maybe that I was going to say that Doubt and Slams will go over MBL and MBL will be completely dead. But then Leary will be completely full pop and dominate even earlier. So in uh, in the timeline, we just need to see. Look at Leary, guys. Leary in Feudal. He has a lot of farming. He reached Castle. He's much faster than Jordan. And then with this crazy amount of farming... He, look at Jordan. Why Jordan? Because they were facing, right? And he got double the army all the time. And Imperial Age, the fastest in the game. Beautiful. Unbelievable. There you go. Game number six. Another map that should be a good one, right? A good one. Yes, and it's going to be what? Viper, Leary, 
Tatot and Hira. Amazing stuff. Amazing stuff. And uh, the map, kind of awkward. Kind of awkward. Let me just go and check. Casting. And again. Have to reset or not? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, so much. And then this is... GL versus AM Tempo. I have to put all the time. And then all seven games. You can go for the bettings, amigos. Three minutes to go for the bettings. And, uh, well, the map is kind of awkward map. Like, can go the galleys here? And my question is, how the hell do you get the goal here? You cannot make TCs. Can you make a mining camp here? I mean, how do you build mining camps in this area? I don't understand these maps. Well, the stone is here. Another stone as well. And then it's going to be a lot of galleys, I believe. I mean, Viper and Tatos will have a, a important... I don't know if advantage here, but... Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm not a fan of these kind of maps, you know? Because I feel that they are going to go full galleys. I don't know what you think, but still. Let's put the score. That's the score. 2-3 for AM Tempo. Yeah, full creative maps, but... But I don't know. Like, uh, the wood here, I will go, if they know, instead of doing a lumber camp here, I will go this area, honestly. Much safer. Out of the of the range of the of the galleys, for sure. So I believe that they will go for... Yeah. Okay, well, Hira is doing a dock already. Liri is doing the dock in uh, in a hill. Okay, and close to the to the dead fish. Doing another dock. And I'm just checking in my second monitor and the hidden cap four, don't worry. Didn't start anything at all. So we keep going, amigos. We keep going. I'm just checking the civilization and they got Vikings, the Viper, and Italians, Tatot. Hira Portuguese, Leary, Italians. I'm not sure about that choice. I mean, they are good. Portuguese and Italians, but the Vikings is always incredible, you know. I think Vikings should be should be picked, but the problem is that they can't pick because they used the Vikings already. So they cannot repeat. You remember that game that that Hira was Vikings in the 3v3? That's why they don't have the Vikings. They cannot pick the Vikings, you know? Yeah. Okay. He will this area here, that's very smart. Falling completely, and what is he going to do? Leary. Going to the Lumber Camp? I don't know if they know the map, but seriously, here is, is like a most to go. Now, the two scouts, both scouts will take the fish. See. He's repairing, the scouts are coming. Another fishing ship. Being annoying, being really annoying. That was, in my opinion, make not a lot of sense. You know, like for that reason, eh, well, the scouts here. He's going to repair? Not really. Well, he's disturbing a little bit. And now here is up, a little bit slower, but all good. And here, dogs. So, this is basically like water nomad map. Or Bog Island, like, still like this. 
seen a Lambrecam in this area, but to make a Lambrecam there, I insist. Why not here, the Lambrecam? And the wood it are even... Look at these trees. 125 wood. It's these so trees, cool. 100. So the wood is even worse here. Okay. They are going to be in Fuel Age very soon. Leary again, the fastest up. And he will do what? He's doing galleys for Village on Goal. Okay. And how they will do damage? Difficult. What? A stone wall. Oh my goodness. I mean, a stone wall here. Are you kidding me, man? Wow. Okay, well, stone walls, guys. Stone walls. Okay, going with the fish at the back is gonna make another dock. Thank you for the soup. Hello, good sir. Follow good sir. Thank you, man. Legion of Loom. Thank you so much for the two moons. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it, amigo. Look at the wall he's doing, Leary. Smart walls. He has already three dogs. Let's see how much army he's gonna have. Lily has five navy, all others three, so he's one step ahead. If he put all the galleys together, oh boy. Oh really boy. Well, Piper has only galleys, only the possibility to make galleys. He's trying to kill some fish, he's now doing the tower. He's now doing a house, that's amazing, and the tower is gonna help. Yes, it is. But now he's going in. And those galleys, Lily need to join. And, uh, oh boy. Hira has problems. One Valir down, I insist that that... That wood is terrible, man. It's terrible. Lear is going. Gonna lose another Valir. Yeah, they are having problems. And Hira in these maps. I don't know. 23 Valir, 3, 3 Navy. And this seems to be over already. Like, Hira is so behind. He got destroyed. It's true that Lear has some good Navy. But Hira is bye bye. But literally bye bye. Yeah. I have to tell you guys, I don't know what you think. I hate these maps. I really don't like them at all. Well, Hira is so behind, but now Liu has a lot of navy here. He needs to go back Viper. And Hira is already with 24, 25 values. You know? Okay, going back. Let's see if Liu can do something. Liu actually has more navy than... Tatot and Viper together. So, Liu can still dominate completely if he want. And uh, this is what, what he's going to try. How the hell this guy play that good any map, man? <laughs> anyway. They keep trying. The score is close. And now he needs to find some spot to take some damage. And he will on, uh, on the Viper for sure. There you go. Look at the Ferris. Oh, but Leary failed there. He definitely failed. Stone walls. Whoa. Well, guys. Stone walls. That's solid. That's really, really solid. Yeah. The map is uh, not the best, obviously. But now, now Leary is going to do a massive damage on Tatot. Uh, real massive damage. So many galleys. Going to take now a couple of villagers. There you go. Well, he's going to destroy him. One villager down. Two down. He's gonna now take the, the villager in the market. Not really. One villager down. Another one down. There's some demos. But he's gonna take them. If he played properly. One down. Two down. And now he's against Viper. He got the heal, man. He got the heal. Ridiculous, but effective. Need to go back now. Ooh, that was a trap. Because Hira is not there. 
Need to go back. He still did damage. And then, ooh, now he's losing a lot. Losing a lot. Yeah, the problem here is that Hira is so behind. And now, some damage on Lyra's base as well with Tatot. Well, Viper also joined the party and taking absolutely everything. He's gonna kill some fish. Yeah, he's killing some fish. Well, trying to make as much damage as possible. But at the end, he lost some galleys. He's still with eight. And in this situation, Tatot and... Uh, Tatot and Viper are going to go up to Castle. The game is over. Like, this game is just over. Well, this is Mangrove Shallows. It's not really walls. Supposed to be walls, but... Yeah. Very... What? How he managed to go Castle age faster? Fuck. Ha, he, he sell resources? Yeah. Leary has sell the stone as well and everything. To go up as soon as possible. And I forgot that he's Italian. So, he's fast, man. He's fast, but Viper and Tatot are going. The problem here is that it's going to be two versus one. Because Hira is far away from going up. Far away from going up. Oh, wow. Now he's doing some damage. That's good. More villages, man. Yeah, but now those galleys are going to be bye-bye. Also for Hira. Hira still have zero resources, like zero food. So he won't be able to, to go up anytime soon. He's, he's trying to make as much damage as possible. And now Lee is trying to attack. Lee will be in castle, but this is a stone walls. Very, very nice. And uh, when Viper of Tato just, just go there, uh, they will dominate, man. They will dominate. Remember that Sito and Dracon will be the, the next game because they didn't start yet. And uh, I got the maps. I know the draft, but they didn't start. We'll check soon. And the last game of this series, guys, if you don't mind, I will get recorded games and I will do after Dracon and Sito series. So now I will focus on Hidden Cup qualifiers. And then I will do the last game recorded games. Stay tuned for more. Okay. Potkin Arrow, War Galley Upgrade. But they will be in Castle Age, man. Both Tatot and Viper. So now, if they just go together, that's it. Hira is still so far behind. Yeah. Karinin, even. Whoa. Whoa. Well, he's taking one dog. Doesn't matter. They just need to wait and. Oh, Tatot is going to kill. Everything in, on O'Leary's base? It seems so. Okay. No, no, no. He's just sending a couple of them. The scout is bye-bye. And... Uh, yeah, Hira is not even up. I mean, Leary can't... Can't hold against two. No, it's impossible. Okay. Well, this is a bad job by 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 Tatot, I think. He need to wait Viper. Ah, but Viper is there. It's okay. It's okay. It's not a bad job. It's just a domination now. And the game is pretty over. Like, if they kill all those galleys there... Imperial Age! I mean, Tatot is going in. Tatot is on the way to Imperial Age. Come on, man. On the way to Imperial Age in 23 minutes. Fast fire seems and then, well, bye bye. And Hira is losing all the villages here. Destruction, guys. Destruction. They don't give up for respect to the organizer in the so much, but as soon. Oh, Valeri is on the way to Imperial as well. Well, it's Italians, cheaper. Just want to see. You just want to go that. And, uh, well, these maps are one strategy. That's the problem with these maps. That you know that you're going to see exactly this. So they made a map to, to have some cool stuff here. The stone in this one. Also a stone. And the game is over already. I was right. I know something about the game. 3-3. Three, three, no story. They kill fast Hira. And bye-bye.
And there we go. As I promised, we are going to cast this game. Let's see how good it's going to be with Capture H. Okay. Okay. And here we are with a Nomad start with a crazy map. And let's focus and put the rest of this. And this is going to be uh, play all seven. And this is GL. And this is now AM Tempo. All right, we keep going now. And now I will just move the chat. Because the chat can't work with a 4v4. Hopefully the game is gonna be as smooth with, uh, with the capture rates casting. And, uh, well, I mean, to check this is gonna be very difficult, but with capture rates it's gonna help. We have another start and we have civilizations. Vietnam, Malay, Burmese, Spanish, Lithuanian, Scots, Portuguese, Turks. What is these civilizations? I mean, gods, Turks, Lithuanians, Portuguese, I mean, gods here? Much better civilization for, for GL, honestly. Much better. I don't know what you think, but hey. Slam with the tone center, close to, close to MBL, okay? Mm. Beautiful tone center by Hira. You usually make the tone centers on the wood, but hit it in the middle of nowhere. Of course, you're gonna take the fish. That's good. But you want on wood. Otherwise, I don't know. I mean, did he make the dog? Hira? He did here. But now, how the hell do you take the wood? In my opinion, is is bad, man. I don't know. That's what I think. Still. Oh, it was random seed. Okay. Okay. It was random, but you go last game and and then you put random saves. It make no sense to me. Like, like disaster, you know. So. Okay, it's over four minutes. I believe that's that you can kill it, but and that's the score, guys. That's the score. Yeah, I mean, doubt, <laughs> doubt, and the viper, lonely, and then one, two, three. For five players in the same spot. Then Leo Lonely as well. But then we have here Heart and Hira. And here Islam and MBL. Islam is surrounded by three opponents. How the hell Islam is going to survive to this? Islam is in kind of an orgy that he don't want to have. You know? Of course, it's a nice T-shirt. A beautiful T-shirt, right? Well, this is like Nomad, but... What? Hills and fish. Seriously? Leary just... Leary... <laughs> I think Leary... Yeah, Leary just saw this, you know? Since they have Portuguese... He's just taking the tone centers by gray and yellow, and he's thinking disaster. They see a slam here, and this is very interesting. Interesting to see the point of view from uh, from uh, AM Tempo because with Portuguese they have cartography, but they are also in the middle with all the dogs. Why they went here, man? This is a mess. This is a total mess. But honestly, um, this would be, in my opinion, much better situation for for gamer legends. I don't know if you agree, because they have 
two plays Lonely. Doubt and Viper. While only Lear is Lonely. Also Tatot. That is not Lonely, but is far from this. So Islam can disturb, maybe. And then three players from the same team that that closes is never good in my opinion. Because you don't get map control. Well, we will see. Some big battle will be on water in the middle. Islam he will move, I believe. But you know what happened? Slam don't see anything. You know? He doesn't see anything. And Islam is with Malai. So if he's gathering the resources and he's having the food, he will be up super quick. And then he can make towers and be so annoying to his opponents. Super annoying. Let's see. He has the food already, Islam. Look at the food. Ha! Ah, amazing. Where's the dog is for Islam? Look. He got one villain. I mean, he's already out. He has one villain. With that villain, he can make a... a well, an empire. <laughs> and now, as I told you, he's going to stone. And he will start make towers all over. He's going to be incredibly annoying. So Islam is going to delay everyone here. I believe. Okay, let's see. I mean, Lily can be so dangerous, but so dangerous in Castleage? No, in Imp. And uh, remember that Viper will go probably atomize. So it's gonna be difficult. It's gonna be very difficult. Anyway, we will see. More dogs? Okay. Yeah, Slam is in feudal age. And gonna make towers where? Nowhere. Just outpost. Sounds good to me. He knows that he's surrounded. He's doing the town watch. I'm going for... Yeah, look at the town watch now. Yeah, this is his point of view. I'm gonna check his Slam for now. He's the most interesting right now. He's an outpost, man. Don't, don't fight, man. He's an outpost. But... Oh my god. <laughs> But now Slam is, <laughs> is outpost rush, not doing anything. You know, there's still no tower. He doesn't know what to do or what. Tower in this spot, market and plasmid. Okay. What team colors? This is the colors they have. Yeah. Okay. Uh, look up. No. Guys, he's asking me in Spanish if uh, if T90 is just casting in, in English, why I'm not casting in Spanish? You know? If it wouldn't be worth it for me to cast in uh, to cast in uh, in Spanish. What do you think, guys? People in my channel, do you want that I cast in Spanish? Oh! Now this is disaster for Slam. He's one and all here. Hira and Islam is he's gonna go away. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Okay. Well, let's see now. Thank you for following. He's gonna away now. How many villages is gonna away? Hmm? Okay, three six is going away. But what I told you, this is already being some delayed, you know? It's doing a tower, it's a mess, yes, but he got fish, a lot of fish. Second dog. So Islam is just trying to survive, moving more values here, okay? But those villages are completely they're completely locked. Like he can't move those to anywhere. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> no, he's not. He's not being fast enough. Well, oh, and now, 
Oh, 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 masterpiece, amazing. And a slam now doing a tower. He hold it, he's losing one or two villages, but he's doing a tower and trying to save some. Okay, that's good. I like it. I like it. But what happened here? Then Piper is castellate almost. And stone and gold with one mining cap. Amazing. Doubt is booming with the Spanish. Oh, he's gonna make a castle. Oh no, he's booming, right? Oh, but this is terrible for Islam. Well, Islam is definitely getting destroyed. But the team, in my opinion, is in a good position. He just needs to move all the villages now. Hart is doing a castle here. Going with Janissars and... What is MBL doing? MBL, Portuguese, is in Castleage. And they saw a villain fight. Yeah, Islam is just being... Leaks. Rubenstock. What about Tato? Tato almost Castleage as well. And that he has a stone or goal? Uh, okay. Let's see. I'm not gonna cast it in Spanish. Well. I don't mind how many viewers I get. I just have my I stream for my for my viewers for my community, and I have to say that uh, the uh, maybe I get more Spanish viewers. Yes, ooh, but uh, but the Spanish viewers, amigos, support pretty much like zero, so I can't stream in Spanish. Look at the TC is doing. Oh my god. Stone walls, okay. Doubt on four tones and he's booming, man. He's booming, man. He's yeah. Be careful now. Yeah, but this has been working. Now just look at yellow. Going now up to Castellage. But how is the boom here? Like look at doubt already. Look at Doubt Villies. Seriously. <laughs> He's now can make Arabice. But Doubt. Doubt Boom is just going to dominate, man. Seriously. He's, he's, going, he's going to dominate. Okay. Hit Villis on stone. I don't know what he's doing, but but then there is not a lot of action. Like they're booming and nothing really happening. Some galleys, but what is Gray doing? He got some Janissars. It's hard to see where the army is. I don't know if there's an option here. And Brain, if you are around, if there's an option to check the military only. Do we have an option to check where's the army? Because I don't see where the army is from uh from Gray, for example. Yeah, okay. Okay, the, the Janissars are coming. It's hard to see it. In the minimap, yes. I need to I need to be able to switch. And see only the military. Okay. Now I see the military only. That's nice. There's not a lot, so I can see this here. Now look at those. Fire galleys. Oh my. Oh my. Well. It's... Uh, it's sad to say, but... Even if... NBL, Hard, Leary and Hero are ahead. In the score. Five tone center now. What is this? What is this one? My minimap. The hell? Uh, Doubt is going to destroy. Look at Doubt resources, guys. What the hell? 
Doubt has 97 villages in 24 minutes, 100 population. I mean, the boom he has is just insane. He's on the way to Imperial already. He's up to Imp, yes. He's on the way to Imperial. And now he will just go Paladins and kill everything. I told you, man. Yeah, he has four tons and this Leary with uh, 71 villages. But Doubt is just gonna eat everything if they just send some Janissars here, some uh, Arabites to take the Janissars. Then Doubt will have a sick transition. It's minute 25. Okay, gonna lose some villages now. Okay, let's see. Yeah, but the Arabites will deal. Look, look at the Arabites. Yeah, they will kill now. They don't have all the great accuracy, any of them, but still now. Ooh. Well, domination. I put out M again. And you see how they don't have any army. Here's more Arabites here as well. Yet, yeah, I mean, this is the minimap with military and uh, AM tempo. Got no army. They are fully boom. Two Q skulls here. They have no army. I mean, you can check in the in the data. 10, 12, 2, 3, but some of those are on water. No army at all. They, there's not a lot of army from, from GL, but 15 are Arambais. 10 red, Tato, Tess. Well, galleys. you can see the military. It's there. And now, doubt. Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's impossible, man. I mean, it's really impossible. The knights are already plus one. But his imperial plus two. Look at the score by the lord. I mean, he never lost the fish. Look at the Arambais. And now I understand. Some people were telling in the chat, well, that game wasn't that worthy. It really wasn't one of those nomad excited. They boom. They did pure boom. What is MBL doing here? Few galleys? And boom completely. And now, with the castle in front and then cavaliers, I don't know. Total destruction. Leary is still in castle age. Because if Leary will be now in Imperial with, with the gods, he will be able to, to hold, probably. But this is cavaliers and Narabais. I mean, the combination is just deadly. Going with trebuchets, and this is going to be absolutely game over. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he has 77 villages right now. And Islam is still on 47 villages. After all that damage he, he got. Well, the knights are coming in. Yeah, but he's getting raided already. And the knights got the plus two, plus four soon. Now Cavalier. What? A guy in the knights disappear. Well, it's a good end for the game. The knights disappear. Where's the knights? When the knights has come, everything is gone. I love it. I love it. <laughs> well, doubt is too powerful. Too powerful. How? How to make this not happening? You remove the knights from uh, from him. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's let's see the end with with the with the with the units. Let's put the normal one. Let's go with the normal one. I got a good macro there, and because the units disappearing is is an issue with four before. Okay, it happens also with all the all the games today in brain with three v three and with two v two. With not only with 4v4, just to let you know, okay? It happens with with all the modes today in the so much. Anyway, we keep going now with those cavaliers. And uh, he's gonna have the paladins. Oh, he's spamming cavaliers, but he's just destroying, guys. He's just destroying. Leo is in 124 villages. But he's still not Imperial, guys. He's still not Imperial. He's trying to send pikes. 
he might be thinking, okay, I will be able to spam a lot, but how many bullies they have killed already? I mean, MBL 50 bullies are 65, Hira 94, and Tato the Handed bullies. And here we are with all those cavaliers. I don't know why, why Dao don't have panis yet. It's kind of weird. Well, he want to, to send army all the time. 53 farmer, but his population is insane. He's cleaning all. Yeah, MBL is destroyed, 42 villages. And now with the traps, it will, it will be hard. He's coming with the helps. But now, if the Viper is just sending also Arambais. Oh, look at those. This is a slab here. GG, man. And they call the GG. Well, this game. This game has been disaster. The map, you can go. Random, random map for random civilization for for a, for a nomad game, you know. And now I feel even better that I move it for the hidden cap uh, series because that game was, in my opinion, don't know what you think, a sad end for the series and the worst probably game of the series as well, because Dow just boom. And the others didn't do too much either. They tried to boom, but it was slower. They lost some fish. Then Slam denied a little bit, delayed a little bit Hira. You know, an MBL even. And uh, and then Dao just killed everything with the Viper raiding a lot. We can take the achievements. Doubt 43 largest army. He killed the most. The Viper killed a lot too. And Slam did one, one, uh, one military. Hira 5. You know? And... Total destruction, guys. But that was the 4-3. So I have casted the full so much. Hopefully you have enjoyed all the games. Thumb up on YouTube.